New game. Here we go, everyone. We're on an adventure. Hello there. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Prof. That's not, not behind your back, they don't mate. The world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. For some reason, Pokemon... For some, for some reason, for some, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for fights. Myself, I study Pokemon as a profession, because I'm retired and I have little better to do. Pokemons. <laughs> Pocket monsters. <laughs> Firstly, what is your name? Excellent. Uh, new name. I... I <laughs> I'm going to do it like everyone does it the first time they play Pokemon. I'm going to do it all in caps because you don't realize that there's a lowercase until you've already written out your name. And then so everyone refers to you as Mike. <laughs> End. Right. So your name is Mike. Uh, this is my grandson. He's been your rival since you were a baby. Um, what was his name again? I mean, I have no real life rival. No one can rival me, so I, I don't know what I'm gonna name name this person. I mean, while I open my drink, I'm gonna open the idea up to chat if you want a rival name. <laughs> <laughs> no one. Excellent, Rose. <laughs> Fucking nail on the head. Is there a space? Aren't all the names caps in this game? No. <laughs> oh, I don't think so. Maybe. Yes? No. Yes. Yes. I don't know. Is that space? Yeah. <laughs> no one. <laughs> That's right, I remember now. His name is No One. <laughs> Mike! Your very own Pokemon, Pocket Monster Legend, is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures and nightmares, too, with Pocket Monsters awaits. Let's -a go! Sorry, wrong franchise. Mike turned on the PC. Withdraw item, because I remember there's a potion in there. Wow, that is, that is deeply in there. Hi, protagonist mother. Bye, protagonist mother. I'm off to do reckless adventuring. Bye! Hey, hey, wait! <laughs> I always thought he was wearing a cape and not a lab coat when I first played this. <laughs> It's unsafe. Wild Pokemon live in the tall grass. You need your own Pokemon. <laughs> no one, no one can get in the way of what I'm feeling. <laughs> you and me both, Bruce. You and me both. You... It sounds like a fucking attack helicopter outside the window. You need your own Pokemon for your protection. I know. Yeah, come with me. Okay, mental figure. Hey, Zentari, how you doing? Good to see you. <laughs> no one. Gramps, I'm fed up with waiting. No one? <laughs> Let me think. Oh, that's right. I told you to come. Just wait. Here. <gasps> My! <laughs> there are three Pokemon here. Darcy said, I never knew the potion was there. Oh, yeah, potions. You always get a potion at the beginning. I think you, that might be a running trend. I'm not 100% sure. But that's what you're here for. The Come for the nostalgia. Stay for the obscure nuggets of knowledge. A potion in the computer. A potion in the computer. Damn right. They're inside these pokey balls. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. In my old age, I only have three left. Gambling is a hell of a drug. Don't do it, kids. But you can have one. Choose. Hey, Gramps, what about me? Now, no one be patient. You can have one, too. Right. This is the most important choice, and I have already made it in my head. 
unfortunately, I always go for Charmander. Which I know goes against the whole it being Pokemon Blue thing. Obvious choice is Bulbasaur. Okay, let's not start a fight. All right. <laughs> Bulbasaur, seed. Strange seed was planted on its back at birth. The plant sprouts and grows with this Pokemon. I love, I, I, I never pay too much attention to the thing. <laughs> you bait me with Blastoise in the stream name. <laughs> so you want this plant Pokemon Bulbasaur? Uh, no. Tiny turtle Pokemon. After birth, its back swells and hardens into a shell. Powerfully spray, powerfully sprays foam from its mouth. Do you want the water Pokemon Squirtle? No. Squirtle looks so weird. Squirtle does look weird. Charmander looks fucking mean. Obviously prefers hot places. The lizard Pokemon obviously prefers hot places. When it rains, steam is said to sprout from the tip of its tail. It's also said that if the tail goes out, it dies. Fun Pokemon facts for you. So you're on the fire Pokemon Charmander. Now I... I feel like I am baiting people. I don't want to do a bait and switch. Like I don't want to say Blastoise in the title, it being Pokemon Blue, and then me be like, Maha, Charmander. But... I always, um, weirdly, I always chose Charmander uh, as, a, as a beginner Pokemon. And it's only when uh, like Gen 3 came out or something like that, I realized, actually, that's hard mode because you, your first gym is rock, which fire is uh, strong against, uh, fire is weak against. And your second gym is water, which is strong against fire. I never really picked up on that. So it being Pokemon Blue and me never doing a Squirtle run and undeveloped Bruce potentially killing one of my D&D characters during our next session, I am going to get less of the last one. I know Bruce wouldn't do that. Uh, it's okay. We support all of your choices. Okay, I'll go with Charmander then. <laughs> yep, go for it. You received a Charmander. I just like dragons, man. I just, that's why I had a dragon fetish. Not fetish, that sounds weird. I had a dragon, like, no, that, there's no other words. Interest, when I was younger. I scrubbed that bit from the internet, all right? I don't want, the last thing I need is fucking weird fan art, all right? It's not a dragon until Gen 6. I will fight you for that. I, I swear to God, it is a dragon. Charmander grows into a dragon. If I can teach it to fly, and it's got a flamethrower, it's a dragon. <laughs> I will nerd fight you for this. I choose because I choose. Hello, Echo Alpha. How are you doing? Uh, would you like to give a nickname to Charmander? Yes. I would love to give Charmander a name, but I don't know what it's... I think it's it's going to be... Hot Boy. Obviously. Mike Mander. <laughs> uh, I'll take this one then. No one received a Squirtle. No one received a Squirtle. Right, I'm out. Future Pokemon champion, out. Let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. Fucking music still slaps though, doesn't it? No one sent out Squirtle. Go, hot boy! <laughs> fight! Fight, 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 fight. Enemy Squirtle used Tail Whip, but it failed. Scratch! Hot boy used Scratch. No one wants to get scratched by a hot boy. My defense fell, oh no. Hot boy's defense fell. Come on. Kick it in the shell. Critical hit. 
Used tail whip. My defense fell. If it actually does anything to me, then I'm, I'm screwed. Critical hit. Enemy Squirtle fainted. Hot Boy gained 70 XP and grew to level 6 already. They grow up so fast. Mike defeated no one. That's an easy win. <laughs> GG easy. Unbelievable. I bit the wrong Pokemon. I, and I've robbed you as well. <laughs> I just rifled through your pockets. Oh, okay. I'll make my Pokemon fight. Toughen it up. Gramps, Mike, smell you later. Douchebag! Da -da -da -da. Hello! You're my favorite person. Technology is incredible. You can now store and recall items as Pokemon as data by a PC. Because they are in. Is it Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee? That you get like a 3D version of them and they're, they're, they say the same line. Isn't technology incredible? Wait, are you are you healed? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus! That. I can switch but. How does that class as a move? Anyway, Wild Pidgey appeared. I'm going to get on to some house rules soon. Kill it. Kill it with, well, not fire yet. Used Gust. Gust. Pop Boy used Scratch. Enemy Pidgey fainted. Anyway, I do that much more, I'm going to give myself a headache. So I can switch between the two colour palettes that I chose. The original and the black and white. Do we have a preference? Anybody got any preferences? I think maybe the colour one. Maybe that's slightly better. Oh, hello. Hi, I work at the Pokemon. It's a convenient shop, so please visit us in Viridian City. I know, I'll give you a sample. Here you go. Yoink. This song is the one I always whistle. Neat is one of those songs. This and Bob on Battlefield from Super Mario are my two um, just brain marbles that just roll around. Like whenever I'm walking somewhere or I, sometimes if I'm anxious, like if I'm anxious, humming or whistling Bob on Battlefield will, will calm me down. It's weird. Hey, yeah. See those ledges along the road? It's a bit scary, but you can jump from them. You can get back to Pallet Town quicker that way. Trainer tips. The battle moves of Pokemon are limited by their peepees. To replenish peepees, rest your tired Pokemon at the Pokemon Center. Co color clearly, yeah, because black and white. I like the idea of black and white, but color, color definitely feels better. Telling you to jump from a ledge. Don't remember that being <laughs> being this dark. <laughs> Look away, YouTube. It's all over. Ah! <laughs> oh, I never. I was so excited to play. I never did an intro for YouTube. I'll do an intro for YouTube later. I do. So many clips of me just fucking dancing in this game. <laughs> Pokemart. Hey, you came from Pallet Town. All the nurses look the same. Let's not let's not get onto the whole nurse Joy Officer Jenny thing. So I may or may not have had a bit of a crush on Nurse Joy and Officer Jenny. As did everyone. Man, woman, anybody, any gender you pick. Everyone had a crush on Nurse Joy and Officer Jenny back in the day. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Will you take it to him? Fucking lazy bastards. Yes, I'll take it to him. Your crush was Brock. I mean, that's, that's an odd choice, but yeah, okay. Had a crush on Misty. Wasn't she like 11? He was a teen too. Eleven. <laughs> That's not a teen, Centaria. A friend of mine. 
<laughs> oh, Mike, how is my old Pokemon? I literally walked up the road and back, mate. Well, it seems to like you a lot. You must be talented. Pokemon trainer. What? You have something for me? Mike delivered Oak's parcel. Because apparently I work for fucking Amazon now. Ah, this is the custom Pokeball I ordered. The Master Ball. It's the Master Ball. Oh, yeah, we got the Pokedex. I forgot about the Pokedex. What did you come for? Oh, right. I have a request for you two. These voices will vary wildly, by the way. Uh, on the desk there is my invention, the Pokedex. Uh, it automatically records data on the Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Right, so we have... Let's just run this past. Let's run this back. Rewind a second. We have the technology to store items digitally as data in a computer. Items! But we don't have a high-tech encyclopedia for the animals that completely populate our own world. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. Just so we're all aware. Mike and no one. Take these with you. <laughs> no, that's what the bookshelf is for. Oh, I see. I see. So technically, we have evolved for past item storage technology, but we're still basically, in the knowledge era, we're still basically using the Encyclopedia Britannica and not... We're now moving on to Encarta, is, is what I'm trying to get to. <laughs> Mike got Pokedex on Oak. I don't think I ever filled the Pokedex. Uh, it'll be a complete guide to uh, po all Pokemon in the world. Uh, that was my dream, but I'm too old. I can't do it. That's it. That's a can't do attitude, friend. So I want you to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. <laughs> all right, Gramps, leave it all to me. Mike, I hate to say it, but I don't need you. I know. I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I'll tell her not to lend you one, Mike. Ha 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 ha. A, I think I can remember the layout of Kanto. B, fuck yourself. And that's how you deal with bullies, kids. <laughs> Push start to open the menu. Oh, okay. All of this Pokemon related knowledge. Crammed full of Pokemon books. Crammed full of Pokemon books. Good collection you've got here. Would be a real shame if a Charmander was just lean against it. <laughs> Let's go. I'm not looking at the screen. I'm too busy vibing to the music and keep walking into walls. Hot boy. Come on, hot boy. It's only in recent years I've actually started nicknaming my Pokemon. Um, when I first played it, I hated the idea of nicknaming Pokemon. I thought they deserved their true name, their their actual name. All the juicy crap. Wait, that's Fallout. <laughs> Oh, I cannot wait to hear the gym battle again. Oh, my days. Oh, I'm so looking forward to it. It's a rash start. I actually quite like rash start. Well, I like Raggate, right, okay, so. You used to use your actual name, but with a typo in it to annoy my siblings. <laughs> That's it, it, fair. <laughs> I don't remember. I, I'm pretty sure I didn't play this with my sister because my sister's five years older than me. So this wasn't in, this wasn't her bag. Um, but I played it with my best friend. I say my best friend at the time. I'm still my best friend. I could never nickname a Pokemon either. Yep, fair enough. Um, now I am regretting nicknaming Charmander Hotboy. I'll be honest with you. Uh, but I think being the jewel in the Char Charmamber. <laughs> Brilliant. Um, being the jewel in the crown that's going to be my Pokemon team, I think Hot Boy is uh, is definitely going to be. So, you know, it's one of those names you just like. Oh, you are oh, the dreaded Fluffy, that sort of thing. You're just like, well, there's nothing scary about that. And then a fucking dragon lands in front of you, and you're like, because it's a dragon, Greeny Green. 
a dragon. <laughs> uh, welcome to the Pokemon Center. We heal your Pokemon back to perfect health. Shall we heal your Pokemon? Yes, please. Thank you, your Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. Right, so, house rules, right? I know some people were like, are you gonna... I think Greeny Green turned around and said, being the re one of the resident Pokemon experts in chat, turned around and said, um, there's Nuzlocke rules, which is like, if a Pokemon faints, it's dead, so you have to, like, release it. Uh, you're only allowed to catch a one Pokemon from each area, the first Pokemon you see from each area. I have different house rules. I'm not gonna follow those specifically. I think if a Pokemon faints, you can't take it out of circulation because that can be an absolute game killer, to be honest with you. Um, I think what I probably am going to do is what I just, but what I used to stick by when I was younger is not oversaturating my uh, my Pokemon collection. I'm not going to capture every single Pokemon I encounter. I'm going to catch a, probably one or two of something, right? But also, I'm not going to have like. How many were there? 151? How many can you have in a team? Six? I'm not going to have 145 Pokemon sat in the box. Right? I hate that idea. So I'm going to have a, a team A and a team B sort of thing. So that's what I'm going to... I'm probably going to... I'm probably going to go for. Uh, right. Uh, speaking of which, I want some Pokeballs. Because I do want Pidgey. Because... I mean, Pidgeys are pretty great, to be honest with you. Although I, I think I was always that nerd who was like, Oh, I like Spearow more than Pidgey. Even though it's portrayed in the anime as just a really ugly pigeon, uh, I think I, I think that's it. I think I can now go. I don't think there's anything else I can pick up here. Hi, uh, pigeon. Oh, Spearow, of course it is. <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to insult you there. Oh yeah, the gym. The Viridian City Gym. Viridian City Pokemon Gym. This Pokemon gym is always closed. I wonder who the leader is. Let me just sneak. Ah! Let me just sneak around. The gym's doors are locked. Damn it. And apparently forceful. <laughs> just threw me off the ledge. Hi. When I go when I go to shop in Pewter City, I have to take the winding trail in Viridian Forest. Oh yeah, Viridian Forest, I forgot about that. Oh, I've had my coffee now and I feel great. Same. Sure, you can go through. Are you in a hurry? Yes. Oh, time is money. Go along then. I'm pretty sure I just teach, they just teach me how to catch Pokemon for no reason. I remember being shook by the Pewter City gym leader reveal. <laughs> Trainer tips. Catch Pokemon and expand your collection. The more you have, the easier it is to fight. Brock was introduced in the anime as as the gym leader, as Pewter's gym leader, right? And Misty was not Viridian. Oh, Jesus. The other one. Yeah, I've completely forgotten names. I've completely forgotten names of places. <laughs> Cerulean. Thank you, Centaria. Cerulean. That was a quiz. You passed. Are you going to Viridian Forest? Be careful. It's a natural maze. Or is it an unnatural maze? Ratchet may be small, but its bite is wicked. Did you get one? Not yet. Uh, I think they're in Viridian Forest as well. I 100% want a... Uh, not a Cappy. What's the other one? A Weedle. Because who doesn't want a wicked Beedrill? I came here with some friends. They're out for Pokemon fights. Cool. Trainer tips. If you want to avoid battles, stay away from the grassy areas. Oh no, but I'm in a grassy area. Oh no. <laughs> Couldn't have tied that better. A wild cat appeared. Go, hot boy. <laughs> or if you're playing Bruce's game, carpet pie. Cappy is cute. Cappy is very cute. I I think the thing that put me off Cappy uh, Metapod slash um, Butterfree was <laughs> was uh, the anime because I just I didn't I didn't care after so much time had passed and then be and then Butterfree came out and it's just like 
it feels like the most useless Pokemon. It just feels like the Pokemon that's just like, oh, I can poison stuff. Like, that's what I do. That's my that's my thing. Whereas Beedrill's like, I incinerate things with my pincers. Like, that's, that's what I do. I stab things repeatedly. Hello. I ran out of Pokeballs. And I like bees, so... Which is weird, because when I was younger, I didn't, so... Maybe it was maybe it was subconsciously my way of like taming my fear. It's way way too fucking deep for. How old was I when this came out? Twenty four years ago. I was like ten. Way too fucking deep for ten year old Mike. Leech life or was it sleep powder? It might have been sleep powder. Um, Leech life is a plant move, I believe. Should always carry extras. Yeah, you really should. Hey, you have Pokemon. Come on, let's battle them. <laughs> Bug catcher wants to fight. Send out a Weedle. <laughs> I'm getting flashbacks of playing the cursed version of this where I literally kill trainers. Fucking hell. Like I delete their sprite. Used poison sting. Am I now poisoned? Fuck. I don't have a thingy. This is going to go badly, folks. Hurt by poison. Ow. Wait, do I have an antidote? Nope. Come on. Use poison sting. Scratch. Ooh, boost level 8. Do I heal on a level up? Nope. But catch us in doubt. Can it be? Hurt by poison! Fuck! That may have been a mistake on my part. Hurt by poison! Tackle! Uh, I item. Hot boy! Healed again. Hot boy is hurt by poison. <laughs> Enemy can be used tackle. Let me tell you why everyone loves Beedrill. It has those two huge pincers that drills into the behind of those human enemies. Absolutely. Like, I really don't understand, like, canonically why there was never, like, a Pokemon uprising. <laughs> like, you just get a horde of Kangaskhan. Like, Nothing in Kano is going to stand in the way of that. You have a stronger version to Wasp. That's fair. Hot boy gained levels and poison. Right, so this is where everything could go. Oh, the Ember. Fantastic. Uh, this is where everything could go horribly wrong. Because now I'm poisoned. Now I'm going to have to get back to the Pokemon without Hot boy dying. Otherwise, I pass out. No, Caterpie can't cut it. Right. Ow. Ow. How many points of life is that? Pokemon. 17. Is that just one point of life? Yeah. 16. 15. 14. 13. 12. 11. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, fuck. Anxiety! Potion. Fucking top you up, mate. There you go. It's alright. We had it in hand. It's fine. Can you die from poison? I'm pretty sure you can. Actually, I'm... Now I'm not certain. Now you've said that. I think if it's your last Pokemon as well, that means you pass out. And that would be, oh boy, I like 20 minutes into the stream. That would be real fucking embarrassing. Thank you, your Pokemon are now fighting fit. We hope to see you again. How do Pokemon stay in business? Are they just like government funded? These are the questions I never asked myself when I was younger. Hi there, may I help you? Bye. Antidotes. I'll take some of those, thanks. Yeah, cheers. Thank you. 
Uh, and I now... Oh, you have no potions! You're shit. All right, fine. I'll... Fine, I'll do it myself. I don't need your potions. I've got positive thoughts. <laughs> Pidgey. <laughs> You've got Ember now, so it's easy, I guess. Well, yeah, until I get to the gym. And then it's against rock Pokemon that are uh, pretty much immune to fire damage. <laughs> Which is why I would like, uh, well, I'd like a Spearow if I can get one. I think you can get one in Viridian. I just don't think it's a common drop. I think it's rare, not rare, but like uncommon. I was trying to think of the the word then. Right. Anyway, where were we? <laughs> I believe I was going. No, 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 no. I beat your Pokemon. Suck it, Bug Catcher. Hi. Yo, you can't jam out if you're a Pokemon trainer. I don't think those words mean what you think they mean, friend. But Catcher wants to fight. But Catcher Tenarido. Go, hot boy. Burn him to death. Add a boy. <laughs> it is super effective. And next, Kakuna. That's what fucking Weedle turns into. Although Kakuna always looked like it could do damage, unlike Metapod. Metapod just looks cack. Kakuna always looks like it could do damage. Level 10. Ah. Okay, just in a Weedle. Oh, shit. And now, hot boy, we set the world on fire. <laughs> you thought you could stand a chance. <laughs> I ran out of Pokemon. Just drown them in bodies. Uh, let's go this way. Uh, I'd struggle with my Bulbasaur through the forest. Yes, that's true. The payoff was great when I found the use him in the gym. Yes, Bulbasaur's very effective. Squirtle's even more effective because Squirtle... Uh, no, it's Bulbasaur, isn't it? Because Bulbasaur is good against the first two gyms, I think. Because it's good against rock and it's good against water. Are there any Pokemon in this grass? Is this even a thing? Have I come to the only uninhabited forest in the world? Hey, another potion. Fantastic. Ten-year-old Mike would have loved a fucking walk through Viridian Forest. That carefree. Wait, hit up. What's the hurry? It's because they've probably seen me set fire to a few Pokemon already. Bugcatcher wants to fight. Bugcatcher's an out Weedle. I mean, it's a level 9 Weedle, but it's still a Weedle. Go, hot boy. Burn it to death. Oh, so close. So very close. It is super effective though. Poison Sting. Ha! I'm not poisoned though, am I? Am I? <laughs> That's right. Faint. Burn. Level 11. I used to remember what... Um... Echo Alpha, thank you very much. It's not mine, but thanks. <laughs> I'm using the Super Game Boy. I'm using it plugs into the SNES. <laughs> Do you want to show us a quick? Uh, this is what we had originally. Which I got to admit, I mean, it could have been, but it's good enough. But it could have been better. But they did Bulbasaur real wrong. I mean, Squ Charmander looks fine. Whoever made this was clearly a Charmander fan, right? Squirtle looks off. Looks like an anomaly. Bulbasaur just looks like, I don't know. That's a face only a Venusaur could love, you know? Anyway, uh, change that. Beep boop. Oh, I love this one, though. Like, love it. I'm not being mean to, to your Squirtle. I'm not being mean to your Squirtle. I'm being, I'm saying that the artist impression of that Squirtle. Look, Bruce, you gotta you fucking chill, all right? 
Gotta calm down. I'm just saying, no one did Squirtle well on that on that overlay. Squirtle's a cute little guy. The Squirtle Squad, one of my favourites. One of my favourites in the in the anime series. I thought they were well cute. Now I feel like I'm backpedaling. I don't fucking need to. But... Oh, good, an actual wild Pokemon. So long as you don't go after Totodile, we're okay. Totodile? I don't... Oh, that was... Is that the other water one? I'm now going to have to Google Totodile. Totodile. Oh, no, Totodile's fine. Yeah, I should probably... I probably should have guessed from the name that it was a crocodile. Gen 2 War. I played Gen 1 and I vaguely remember Gen 2. What was Gold and Silver? Was that Gen 3? You love mischievous war, boys. It was a fucking terror. You, you're a nightmare at American football games. Jesus Christ. Uh, Ember, go. Burn you to death. Gold and Silver Gen 2. Right, cool. That's where it stops. <laughs> oh no. Ruby Red. I played Ruby Red. Gold, silver, crystal, or Gen 2. Yeah, fuck, I, I stopped after Gen 2. It got a bit much, I think. I, I really liked that there was 150, and then there was suddenly another 150, and I'm like, oh, no. Um, yeah, not Omega Red, Ruby Red, because there was Leaf Green, and Leaf Green and Fire Red, which were the remakes. Let's see what we can get here. Come on. I have lost my fucking stream manager now. There it is. You kind of quit the anime after it. Yeah, yeah. I quit the anime after Kanto. That was for me. That was a perfect end. Him not becoming a Pokemon Pokemon Master. Perfect end to it. That was just fucking spoilers. But that was the perfect end to it for me. Your groceries put away and the shower to take. Be right back. For leaving the stream. Ah, oh, fantastic, Keiko. Thank you very much. Oh, enjoy your grocery putting away. I had a really good shower today. Like, do you know when you get a shower and it's like, yeah, I've had a shower. And you know when you get a shower, like. You know you've had a good shower. Oh, the color palette. I've never played through this in color either. This is a thing. The color palette here are, um, it's, it's like, it's brown because it's a rock place. I really, Ash dumps Pokemon as well as friends. What an asshole, really? At the end of, at the end of that season of Pokemon. Well, he's, he's just like, all right, Pikachu, let's fucking dump these losers. Any Pokemon that takes part in battle, however short, earns XP. Yes, I am. I am aware of the Magikarp uh, uh, strat. I've actually got my Magikarp, my uh, good luck Magikarp, but my wife got me on top of my mono. Because Magikarp is my favourite Pokemon. <laughs> what a beautiful song. I'd sure her. <laughs> Sorry, I must have not enough. He starts every new region fresh with just Pikachu. Wow. He tried to dump Pikachu but failed. Jesus Christ. You used to sing the jiggly jiggly buff. <laughs> is that your is is that your misspelling of jiggly buff, is it? In the so a song in the playground at school. <laughs> Brilliant. I don't need to be here. Why am I here? I just wandered in. I'm just, I'm just browsing. Sorry. Sorry, Nurse Joy. I'm just, I'm just browsing. I can't. Oof, where's my fan? Is it warm in here? It's warm in here. Right, where are we going? I still imitate Jigglypuff quite realistically. Everyone has a talent. Everyone has a talent. Uh, purchase. Do you have potions? You do have potions. I will take five of your. I will take three of your finest potions. I didn't realize they were quite that expensive. Thanks. I never use escape ropes. I don't think. Burn heals. I'll take one of. Uh, wait. Do I need a burn heal yet? No, I don't need burn heal yet. Only awakening. I might need a par par I don't know that. A paralyze heal though. I might. I don't know, but I might.
Uh, well, I guess. I mean, I've got to go to the gym, right? So let's I tell, let's have a stab with my one Pokemon. Because I can't remember what level Brock's Pokemon are. Hey, up, mate. Hiya. I can tell you. I can tell you have what it takes to become a Pokemon champ. I'm no trainer, but I can tell you how to win. Let me take you to the top. Nope, I have chat for that. Thanks. Uh, it's a free service. Let's get happening. The first Pokemon... Wait, so I don't even get a choice? Fucking hell. Oh, would you like my advice? No. Well, my advice is this. Fuck off. Don't be this guy. Fuck off. The first Pokemon out in the match is at the top of the Pokemon list. By changing the order of Pokemon matches, uh, matches could be made easier. I only have one. I only need one. Hi, friend. Stop right there, kid. You're still light years from facing Brock. You grew up in Detroit. Smoking 50 a day. This junior trainer. Sent out a Diglett. Stared me right in the eyes. I didn't know what was beneath that earth pile, and I didn't want to find out. Scratch. Good. Excellent. This is going to go well. Scratch. I mean, in fairness, Ember is a powerful move. I just don't think he's going to be very powerful against this. Uh, fuck it. Yeah, scratch. Ow. I'm fine. Good. Now, piss off. Diglett dig, diglet dig. Trio, trio, trio. Diglett dig, diglet dig. Trio, trio, trio. Anger is a level 12. Is that a sand shrew? God, oh, sand shrews. Uh, I was just, uh, just going to just give you a little drinky drink. Attaboy. Hot boy, used scratch. Sandro used scratch. I'm not gonna live through this. Hot boy used ember. That was better. Sandro used sand attack. Hot boy's accuracy fell. Hot boy needs another potion. He needs his happy juice. <laughs> Sandro used sand attack. Hot boy's accuracy fell. Hot boy used ember. His attack missed. He's got all the sand in his face. Hot boy used ember. His attack missed because of all the sand in his face. He used ember. He missed because of all the sand in his face. Hot boy used ember. It hits. <laughs> Hot Sentry was burned. Sentry used scratch, and Sentry was hurt by the burn. You're a shit sand slash. That's the that's a good burn. Uh, just, just, just a little bit of pokey juice. This is not, this is not a good indication of me winning the next fight. Sandro used sand attack. Hot boy's accuracy fell. Sandro was hurt by the burn. Uh, shit. Fight. Uh, mm, I don't know the accuracy of these two moves, actually. Uh, Scratch probably has higher accuracy. Wait, wait, do moves have individual accuracy? I can't remember. Hurt by the burn. Uh, just don't give me a pity win. There we go. I'm like, I don't want to win by default. I gained 200 and something XP and grew two levels? I think I grew two levels. I defeated Junior Trainer. I think they're both 100. Okay, cool. God, God damn, I'm going to lean on you for this greeny green. <laughs> Light is in time. It measures distances. Yeah, all right. Give me your lunch money. Uh, all right, well, there he is. Handsome Brock. And uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna nip nip out to the to the Pokemon Center real quick. Let's take a punt. Pokemon, that's another one potion. That's another one potion that I can buy now, isn't it? Oh no, I can buy. Uh, yeah, ooh, fucking hell. Let's buy. All right, let's buy two. Thanks. Wait, how many have I got? How many potions do I have? I have three. That's okay. That's okay. I really should have caught more Pokemon by now. Really should have. Hi, Joy. Yes, please.
Hope to see you again soon. I used to know shit like the accuracy of, of different moves and stuff like that. Hot boy only one, let's go! <laughs> Wonder why they named the nurse Joy. Uh, as a kid, you never questioned it. Dunno, why do they name the police officer Jenny? Sup, rock boy? I'm Brock. I'm Pewter Jim's leader. Pewter Jim leader. I believe in rock hard defense and determination. I bet you do. That's why Pokemon, my Pokemon are all rock type. You still want to challenge me? Fine then. Show me your best. Fucking tune! <laughs> Geo dude, which looked just for the life of me, right? Just looked like when I I played this and I thought, to, honest to God, that this was a bowling ball with a nub on its head. <laughs> Because I ended up playing this originally. I think I played this before watching the anime. Um, so I knew I knew the, the things before the anime came out. I'm not saying I'm, I, oh, I knew before the show. But like I just didn't know what Geodude was. Like I didn't realize it was a rock. It was a geode, right? I didn't know what a geode was at 10 years old. I didn't realize it was a geode. Uh, since you asked... Joy was somehow off-putting for me. Jenny is absolutely glorious. I love Officer Jenny. Misty, I'd rather tear my ears off and smack her with them. I mean, Echo, you fair points. Maybe it's the maybe it's the soothing, comforting nature that uh, Nurse Joy offers. I don't know. Uh, I'm I'm gonna do Ember. I'm gonna see. <laughs> fucking missed. Use tackle. Well, that's a <laughs> just Brock and <gasps> Mike just fucking stare at each other like. Let's just forget that one happened, shall we? Gave Geo do such a great hairstyle. That's not very effective. Okay, smack. I mean, in fairness, neither's his tackle. So. <laughs> I'm sure his tackle's very effective. Oh my Christ, that was rubbish. Critical hit. Okay, I see how this is going to go. I just need to burn you to death. Defensive curl. Cool, thanks. Just make this fucking harder for me. It's not very effective, and he used tackle. Hot boy used ember. It's not very effective. Geodude do use defensive curl. Hot boy used Ember. It's not very effective. Geo dude used defensive curl. Hot boy used Ember. It's not very effective. Geo dude used tackle. Please don't get crit. Now, do I heal now? Oh, heal now. There you go. I take another hit and then heal again when Onyx comes out because Onyx is. Fuck it, I, I loved Onyx. Absolutely loved Onyx. Um, Ember. I barely know her. Right, it's not very effective. Suck it, Geo, dude. Brock sent out Onyx. Mm. I mean, I am going to heal again. Wait, am I... I'm four, yeah, 14. 14 points. That's close enough. Got this music. Oh. Yeah, that's all right. Used bide. Oh. Hot boy used ember. This is, a, this is gonna be a long battle, folks. A long battle. It's not very effective. Onyx unleashed energy. Wabam! Oh, hot boy used ember. Oh, it's not very effective. Fucking bide was. <laughs> Health juice. Tackle. Whack. Used by this is not gonna end well for us. It's all over. It's all over. Oh, I never saved. Oh Fuck. It's fine. It's fine. Have I got I have nothing else, do I? No. 
critical hit? No. Oh, it's if. Look at that. <laughs> no. I have one hit point left. You fuck. You absolute stone snake bastard. I gotta give it to him, though. That was a good fight. He's out of usual Pokemon. He passed out. Thud. Oh, well, I'm back. <laughs> Death count one. <laughs> Wait, have I actually been healed? Oh, God, no. Uh, yes, I have actually been healed. Okay, okay. So, I know what I need to do. One more level for Hot Boy. One more Hot Boy level. One more. Wait, hang on. How how many XP do I need for another level? Give me your stats. You're at... That's a lot of information there. 108 points you need. How much am I going to get from fighting a Pokemon? Like six or something like that. I'll just try again. That was just a case of me. That was resource management gone bad. That fight. Go, hot boy. Scratch. Ooh. Oh, 20? Oh, that's not too bad. That's like a couple of fights, so... Say a couple. You know what I mean. Beep. Let's just ember you. Ember to death. Flambe! Ooh, a rata. I mean, I'm tempted. I am tempted. Can I just catch you now? No. Okay. It appeared to be cool. It used tail. Whip. I'm 10 levels higher than you. How am I going to... All right, real talk. Who else always holds the A button when they try and catch Pokemon? <laughs> Who else does it? Go on, show of hands. <laughs> we all know we do it. We all read that one article that time in that one Nintendo magazine or that one person told us in the playground, if you press and hold the A button, you'll always catch them. A, B, A, B, A, B. Is that the code, is it? Nice. Ratata, the rat Pokemon. Bites anything when it attacks. Small and very quick. It is a common sight in many places. As the ball swings, that's what it is? A, B, A, B, A, B is the ball swings. That's what you do, is it? Do you want to give him an answer? Like, no, it's fine. He's not the crown jewel. He's a supporting act. Oh, I should have switched him around. No. Doesn't work, but you do it. Yeah, I, I always hold the A button whenever I throw a Pokeball because it, I've just conditioned. It's confirmation bias, right? When it doesn't work, it's because you didn't press it at the right time. And when it does work, it's because you pressed it at the right time and it works. <laughs> That's how it works, right? Ember. I should have called that Ratata. That's two levels higher. 40 points. Cool. Now, do the old switchery. Switch. It looks like a. Oh, what's the what's the one that looks like a moose that you can't get in this version? I think you can get it in the other one. Taurus. It's like a Taurus. Taurus. No. Is it a Taurus? Wow. I've realised I've forgotten a lot about the original Pokemon lineup. Uh. Nope. Switchy, switchy. I can't remember which one it was, but I'm pretty sure the Taurus you can only get on Pokemon Red. And I didn't have Pokemon Red, I had Blue, hence why I have Blue now. Um, and I was always uh, upset. As if you missed. I was always upset because I am a Taurus. And I really wanted one. <laughs> and I, there was something about Pokemon that didn't evolve. Like, they only had one form that really intrigued me. You know? I mean, obviously, now I realize there was a plan for all of them with evolutions, de evolutions, that sort of thing. But I do wonder at which point in the gen life cycle, fucking hell, hot boy, hit the target. Scratch. 
Sand attack isn't permanent. You don't... You're not... I swear to God. Finally! Oh my God. You get Taurus and both. Which was the one you get? All right, Greeny Green. Let's put your knowledge to the test. And your Google skills. What's the red specific Pokemon? The Pokemon you can only get on Pokemon Red. Because I'm sure there was one. Well, my lights went out then. I'm sure there was one that was really. Maybe Kangaskhan? I thought you could get Kangaskhan in both. I'm certain you can't get Taurus in one of them. I am certain. Pidgeot! Stop, says. Pidgeot looks very nice in this game, doesn't it? I think uh, Pidgeotto looks alright and Pidgeot looks ridiculous because Pidgeot looks like it's having a bad back day. Um, if memory serves, anyway. There you go, one more level. Cool. But Pidgey looks adorable. Uh, Pokemon Center. Growlithe and Arcanine. Scyther and Pinsir. Electrobuzz Magma. Bellsprout. Oddish. Coughing and Ekans. So those are the ones you can only get in red. Not the ones you get in blue. Weird. Maybe it was Growlithe then. Which is nothing like Taurus. I'm sure you couldn't get it. Uh... Weird. Because I remember not having one, and I remember really wanting one. Oh, wait! Hang on. You could only get them from the Safari Zone, couldn't you? Maybe that's what I'm thinking about. Maybe I, maybe I just couldn't get them from the Safari Zone when I tried. So maybe in my head, they weren't like readily available. I know you can just go as far as I want if you want, but they weren't like readily available. Yeah, that's where you remember them. Uh, do I have anything I can sell? No? Cool. So we've got no potions, which is unfortunate. Real unfortunate, in fact. Um, we could do with some, some money. Spare some money, sir? Sir? Madam? Sir? Friend? Friendo? Spare some cash. How do I get in here? Oh, this is how I get in here. Hello. Psst. Do you know what I'm doing? No. I'm spraying Repel to keep Pokemon out of my garden. I've, I forgot about Repel. This makes me want to replay um, Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Because I got Pokemon Let's Go Eevee uh, a couple of years ago now. And I played the first, like two or three hours of it and then didn't play it again I just moved I, I actually we moved house to be honest with you that, that up, upheaved a lot of playthroughs to be honest the craziest Pokemon to catch was Phoebus where it would only spawn in one or two blocks in a giant lake or after every few hours it would reset oh my god that I can't be doing with that. Oh lord. Uh, you're a trainer, right? Brock's looking for new challenges. Follow me. Uh, I'm alright, mate. Thanks. It's the jolliest side mission. If you have the right stuff, go take on Brock. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, mate. Uh, Oddish Lion, Ekans Lion, Mankey Lion, Growlithe Lion, Scythe and Electrobus are red specific, so you'll miss those. Wow. Okay, cool. I'm really confused then. I'll take on Brock for you. I'm sure you will. Wait, can I go in here? No. Uh... This makes me somewhat curious now. Could you find out? Sorry, Greeny Green. I'm sorry to have to basically ask you to be my intern on this, but it's an unpaid position. I'll pay you an exposure. Um, could you f let me know what ones are blue specific then? Because my whole life might have, up to this point, might have been a lie. 
I might be suffering from cloud strife syndrome where I've just made something up and believed it so hard it's true. <laughs> Alright, shithead. Come on. Wait, I healed, didn't I? We'll find out. Go, Rasta. Switch. Because even if we die, Rasta will get experience points. Whack. Ember. It's not bad. Thank you. Shut the fuck up. Use the full heal on Geo, dude. How dare you? Uh, Sanctuary line, Vulpix line, Meowth line, Bellspot line, Magma and Pinsir. No, I definitely had uh, Bell Spell and Meowth. Yeah, and Vul yeah, fair enough. So yeah, I definitely had Blue. Thank you. Thank you for that, Greeny Green. I appreciate that. I appreciate you for that. Use the full heal. Okay, cool. Well, this just keeps getting better for me, doesn't it? It's never effective. Which one was I really pissed at that I didn't get them? I don't think it was Oddish because I don't really like poison Pokemon. It might have been Ekans. It definitely wasn't Mankey. Mankeys freak me out. I don't know why. Yeah, Mankeys and Primates freak me out. Growlithe, I would have been pissed if I'd have not gotten a Growlithe, but that doesn't seem like, like I was annoyed. Like I had some significant meaning. I'm not sure. Scyther was pretty awesome. Uh, an Electra Buzz. Wait, the Scyther and Pinsir, not the... Oh yeah, because you get a different, you get a different fossil, don't you? I was not going to get Arcanine. Yeah, I, I, yeah, that's fair enough. And Electra Buzz always seemed like one of those, weirdly, Electra Buzz and Magma seemed like two Pokemon that were there just to fill up the ranks. Does that make, it, does that make sense? There were already better electric Pokemon and better fire Pokemon. So it kind of feel like when push came to shove, they were like, well, we've got 147. Uh, well, what do you need? We'll just make make up a few more. Well, what, what do you mean? I staggered two levels. Hot boy. Right. Will Mike change Pokemon? Mike shouldn't change Pokemon, but he's going to. Arcanine's good. Arcanine's a good boy. Arcanine's a very good boy. Posture check. Oh, thank you. Everyone check your posture. Oh, Echo Alpha is redeemed. Check posture and hydrate as well. Uh, do I have drink left? I do have drink left. Mm. Nice. Um, I also had to, had to change posture and need to hydrate. Uh, they are better than an ice cream cone and a pile of trash, at least. <laughs> <laughs> yep, fair enough. <laughs> uh, right. Now, what am I doing? Get fucking back in line. <laughs> right, that wasn't so bad. Well, bang out. It's not very effective. It was burned. Brock used full heal on Onyx, giving me a free turn. Wabam! It's not very effective. Used Screech. Oh, my defense greatly fell. You're going to kill me in one hit anyway if you use Bide. It's not very effective. It used Bide. Oh, however. Maybe you are. Maybe you aren't. It's two moves, right? And then the third one's the Unleash. Sorry, Rata. I'm sorry. Hot boy, come out. Get him, Radza. Onyx unleashed energy. Wha-bam! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Someone's got me the meat shield. Get him, hot boy. No, are you scratch? No, that was shit. Use tackle. That's going to be my undoing. Used ember. Is that very effective? Used bite. That's okay, as long as you don't fucking miss again. Yes! We did it! <laughs> Onyx fainted. Hot boy gained 324 experience points. Oh, however, Rattata fainted, didn't it? You learned Leer. 
Another one of those moves you immediately delete when you get a better one. Oh, Rattata doesn't gain any experience because Rattata fainted. But still, we defeat Rattata, so... Uh, I took you for granted. As proof of your victory, here's the boulder badge. <laughs> Leer, Dutch for leather. Excellent. And it's about as useful as leather in a fight. Uh, it's an official Pokemon League badge. Its bearers' Pokemon become more powerful. The technique Flash can now be used at any time. Is that why you're not wearing a shirt? Mike got 1,386 money for winning. Oh, fucking, I robbed the joint as well. Wait, take this with you. Receive TM34. A TM contains a technique that can be taught to Pokemon. A TM is good only once, so when you use one to teach the new technique, pick the Pokemon carefully. <gasps> Hot boy. Oh, bite. Okay. Your Pokemon will absorb damage in battle and then pay it back double. Hang on a second. So I could just have not done anything and that move wouldn't have hurt me. Oh, Bruce. <laughs> I was thinking about this redeem today, and I'm like, I'm going to change these redeems up. I really am. Oh, man. All right, you get, I think it's one minute, isn't it? You get like one minute or something. I can't remember what my redeems are. Let me just check my redeems. Oh, man. Lose the glasses. Five minutes. Five minutes. Fuck. Uh, I could have told you, but it's part of the fun. Cheers, mate. I'm setting a timer. Because otherwise I'll forget. And I'll just sit here for the rest of the like I'm Like I'm cosplaying with no glasses on. Oh my days! Bruce, what have you done? Right. Bruce, Bruce has redeemed Lose the Glasses, which is a redeemable thing on the channel. Um, and basically means that I now have to play without my glasses. And what you don't probably don't know about me is I'm fucking blind without these glasses. I can't read chat. I can barely see the screen in front of me. And I only know that this is there because I made a cardboard sign with a big fucking arrow on top of it pointing to the camera. So enjoy the next five minutes of me not being able to read the menu or text or anything. <laughs> Start. Fucking hell, Bruce. <laughs> I can see shapes, so that's okay. But I'm otherwise I'm <laughs> so I know I know roughly in what direction I'm going in. Uh, is uh, oh shit, that's the wrong button. Is anyone stop? Don't just don't see anything mega interesting in chat. I know. I think. Uh, that's not going to help her. Right, I need to go to the Pokemon Center. That's not the Pokemon Center! <laughs> that means it's down here. It's this other identically square building here. Hi, Joy. <laughs> Do you like the new look? <laughs> I'm going to assume that said heal and not sell all my Pokemon. Something, something Pokemon. I only know it says Pokemon because it's in capital letters. <laughs> do, 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 do. I'm just going to vibe now. That's it. I'm just going to... Just chilling out. Fuck me. <laughs> You're a trainer, aren't you? I don't, I don't know. I don't know what you just said to me. I'm going to assume you're a trainer. Because it just it's someone with dark hair. Is that Pidgey? I recognize the call. <laughs> recognize the call. Can't recognize the brown splodge on the screen. Uh, oh, I know that's Rata. So go Pokemon. Switch out. Switch the first one or the second one? Switch to the first one. Switch to the first one. Good. Thank God. <laughs> Pidgey did a thing. Good. Uh, I'll use... I don't, I don't even know what level it is. It's only one number, though. I can see one one thing. This is what it's like when I cosplay as Silver. 
I, I kid you not, this is what it's like when I cosplay silver. I'm like, I can't see a fucking thing. Uh, scratch. I think that's scratch. Yeah, it's good shit, good shit. Yeah. That's the moves I've got. Good move, shit move, good move, shit move. Wham! Can't believe you've done this to me, Bruce. Although touching my face is a lot easier now, I'll be honest. I think that's Rata. I don't think that says Hot Boy. This must be what it's like to not care about what chat says. <laughs> Uh, oh, I pressed change. Oh, change. Okay, let's change to what I assume was Rattata and not Hot Boy. Yep. Now change back. Switch was the first one. Yeah. Maybe I'm gonna get like super insight and like magic powers to this. Is this good shit? Good shit. So the good one, the third move must be Ember. Was it? No, oh, something happened. I don't know. Oh, the numbers replaced by by letters, so I can definitely that's that's been burned, presumably. Uh, let's go up to this one, scratch. <coughs> so, for anyone just tuning in, I have to play the game for the next five minutes uh, without my glasses because someone redeemed it on channel, and I cannot see. So I'm having to guess what is happening right now. I can see splodges, but like I can't read any of the text, like none of the text at all. I don't know who I'm talking to. I assume it's someone with dark hair, a trainer with dark hair, that's it. And I know that's that's Charmander. And I, I can recognize the calls of the Pokemon more than I can recognize their uh, their names or shapes. Uh, let's go this way. I don't want to have to be surprised by you. I want to talk to you. Guess not. Guess not. Something. Uh, let's make something up. Uh... I was picking berries in the forest, and then I came here, and now you're going to mug me. There you go. That's, that's what that person shouted at me. They're terrified of me. Cappy! Green splodge. Uh, hot boy. Swap them out. Ouch. Well, that deserves a burning. <laughs> I assume that said that's super effective. If that said it's not very effective, that was a really low level carpy. <laughs> oh, thank Christ. <laughs> oh. <laughs> now I get to put my glasses back on because it's been five minutes. Oh, my days. Right, what did I miss? Uh, reading's overrated anyway. Yep, yeah, fair enough. Time to switch to contacts. I can't switch to contacts. I'll tell you about that in a second. Going to miss all the fun conversations right now. Um, hey, Mike, why did you cook and eat all your Pokemon? <laughs> uh, revenge for Squirtle. Perhaps Mike's not going to get back to using his glasses after this freeing experience. A uh, question result is being an asshole. Question result has also redeemed... Um, lose your glasses in the chat to help her. Yay! You fuckers. I hate all of you. Uh, and here was me just wanting to have a nice fun time. Um, and just play some Pokemon. And you're just like, right, five minutes. Cool. Set. Go. <laughs> I'm going to revoke everyone's channel points after this. It was nice while it lasted being able to see. Oh, this is swap Pokemon. Okay. That's what the dialogue box means. Swap it to this one. Uh, that's a Weedle. It's a yellow splodge. And it sounded like a Weedle as well. Uh, Pokemon. Hot boy. I'm glad I've only got two Pokemon. <laughs> this would be real confusing if I'd have caught one Pokemon. Oh my god. Um, something happened then, and I'm not sure what. I'm gonna burn you to death. Yes. I assume that says it's super effective. It's super effective! Yay! Something's leveled up. Something with a long name, so I assume it's Rata. Rata learns something I don't know. <laughs> I don't know because I can't see it. Uh, yes, I will change Pokemon. I will try change Pokemon. Oh, I need to pull my earphones on. Uh, pocket monsters. There you go. 
I vaguely remember there being... So this is a good idea. Oh, contact lenses. I was going to say why I, I can't wear contact lenses. I have oddly shaped eyes, apparently. Um, that, would, that, that didn't hit me, I don't think. Um, yeah, I have oddly shaped corneas, so I can't wear contact lenses. Which I'm fine with. Uh, I, I always enjoyed wearing glasses. Um, I haven't always worn glasses. I only started wearing glasses when I was about... How old was I? It was after mum died, so... I would probably say 14, 15, give or take. Maybe 13, no, 13 feels a bit too young. Yeah, 14, let's go with 14. Um, and being six or five at 14 years old, because I've been six or five since I was like 12, uh, six or five and 300 pounds, or 30 something stone, let's put it that way, like 400 pounds, 30 something stone. I was a, I was a chunky boy. Um, people always assumed you were an idiot. They assumed you were like a cave troll. Right, but then all of a sudden I noticed because I was wearing glasses, people started like talking to me like a normal human being. So they they suddenly I was like an actual person because I wore glasses. Like they assumed I had a brain in my head. More for them, all my brains are in jars. Uh, let's make up some canon story. Um, I am the unpaid intern to Professor Oak, and I've run away. There you go. indeterminate splodge <laughs> wants to fight oh it's a rat huh? at least i recognize that i recognize that voice uh you're not getting my rat though it's always satisfying the first few rubs of your eye are always satisfying and then you're like oh god rub my eye out um fight this move i guess I'm going to guess that didn't kill it. It's great. The health bars, I can see when it goes from green to yellow, but I don't know. I can't see the yellow. <laughs> I can't see what happens when it's yellow. Uh, fight. I'm glad the um, curse is persistent. I'm dying. I'm dying. Uh, it's, I will change my this is what happens. This is what happens when I can't see. Oh, I don't know what I'm fighting. I'm fighting a purple splodge. Is that coughing? I don't know. Nothing looks like it says potion. I have something, space, something. Long word. Med medium word, space, short word. And a TM, because it's got numbers in it. Fuck. Well, I'm in trouble. Uh, okay. Let's... Fuck. Uh, wait. Good shit. Good. I don't know if this is going to work. Well, you, did, you did damage, though. I saw the green go down. My green went down faster than their green went down. But, you know... It's a uh, an Ekins. It's oh, bide. Oh, thank God. Bide, Max. Oh, there we go. Lump these glasses too. You're gonna appreciate your glasses more after this. I yeah, well, I do have to cosplay to be honest. Uh, rap used to really piss me off as a kid. <laughs> wow, that's some high definition Game Boy. Um. Right, what's going on with Hot Boy? Oh, we're fucked. <laughs> we dead. <laughs> Rad, I use Quick Attack. Oh, that's not too bad. Use Rap. Okay, well. Then I'm fucked, aren't I? That's fine. Rad, I painted. If I send you out, that means I'll probably get a move in first because I'm a few levels higher. Fight. Scratch. I was like, please, please kill it. <laughs> uh, oh, now I'm going to change the colour scheme. There we go. Might be... Oh, youngster. Oh, okay. <laughs> that is not what you look like without glasses on, mate. I don't believe it. I got 165 money for winning. Uh, I got it. I got it. 
Wait, we're in dire, dire need of a Pokemon heal, so I'm gonna go moody mode. Oh no. We're in danger, so we have to go all black and white and depressing. Oh no. Oh no. Joy, please help me. Bring the color back to my world. Back to high definition. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Now I can see chat as well. <laughs> Well, I fucking want to after that. <laughs> ah, we're all colourful again. Lovely. Bruce and Jay are just like nervously hovering over the losey glasses redeem. Now I can feel it. I come into the land of clear vision. Clearish. <laughs> Clearer. Are you a trainer? Let's fight. Yeah, clear. Before someone says lose my glasses again, let me just see what that message was. There you go. <laughs> my light's high enough. Yes. Uh, it's okay, I only have 2k points now. Okay, cool. <laughs> I need to figure out some... Um, I might just go and squat in some people's uh, streams at some point and go and see what redeems they've got for their... Uh, their chat points because um, I think mine are alright but they could definitely do with a bit of a judge my mouse really wants to click on some redeem really badly <laughs> hey people can redeem what they want to be honest with you you can redeem whatever you want no one's no one's stopping you I will do it they're there for a reason do you know what I mean wait what do I even have this is going to make a great YouTube episode posh check highlight message hydrate stretch Choose an emo. Emo only chat. That'd be interesting. Uh, ban an in-game action. Don't you fucking dare. Uh, name generator and lose glasses. Stretch. Scratch. Ban scratch. Is that what you mean? What do you mean when I said stretch? Oh, excellent stuff. Redeemed banned in-game item. Thanks. Thanks. Questionable results. It's I assume it was you. Yep, it was you. Okay, cool. So it's good. Is that for a certain amount of time? I can't remember. It's for five minutes. I was only going to ban you using ethers. Ethers on. Obviously, the ethers are thinking this. Scratch. Five minutes. Five minutes. Gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, five minutes. Five minutes. Timer. Timer set. Uh, right, so no scratching, no scratch, no one scratches for five minutes. All right, and we'll just let let you let your itches fester. No one scratches for five minutes. You honestly do not know what actions I have. You can choose any action. You can say like, you can't heal for five minutes, or you can't go down for five minutes, or something like that. You want? Uh, I've never used an ether on a playthrough of any Pokemon or Final Fantasy game. I use one Final Fantasy quite a lot because. Especially Final Fantasy VII Remake. Jesus Christ. So I'm trying to master out all of the material. I can't scratch my nose. No scratches. It just, it's, it's not specific enough. I can't... Anything to do with scratching, I can't scratch. But now I really want to scratch my nose. <laughs> Will my change Pokemon? Yes. Yes. A level 9 Kakuna. I could... We could... We could take this on our own. Quick attack. Wait. Yeah, that's not a scratch. That's fine. Uh, quick attack. I always thought Kakuna had like these really cool pincers and like really cool like blades that it could use. Clearly not, but. Kakuna used Hardon. That's Harden. Just in case YouTube tries to ban me uh, by saying something else. Critical hit. You gain all of the XP, my little friend. And a Caterpie. Uh, no, I'll tell you what. Let's dip it in. See what happens. Ooh, look at it go. String shot. Stupid. It should just be offensive fucking moves. String shot.
You gain more experience. Do you get another move now? Oh no. I think you get me about 11. Mare pod? Oh, fuck it, that sounds like easy money to me. Uh, nope. Harden! I can't hear you, Harden! <laughs> I'm a fucking delight. I might have another one of these. God damn. Metapod fainted. Rush that game. Lots of experience. Aha. If I had new Pokemon, I would have won. I got... Up! Oh, Up! Oh, Hot Boys evolving! Hooray! It's a shame I can't re-nickname you now to, like... Hotter boy. <laughs> you gave me that look you gave me. It's so intriguing. I don't want to fight you. I wanted to go back because everything's injured. Fucking hell. Oh, you're the dark haired person I fought a minute ago. You're the dark haired sludge. Uh, Ratata. The fight of the Ratatas. My genetically modified Ratata, or your free-range Ratata? I think the answer speaks for itself. Maybe. Maybe the answer speaks for itself. I'm not sure. The answer speaks for itself. Yay, got to level 10. He's dying. He's about to use... Oh, a Nidoran. I always wondered why these were the only Pokemon that had genders. Uh, yes, I will change Pokemon. I will change Pokemon to Hotboy. Thanks. <gasps> he's now a Charmeleon. I forgot completely. Ooh. <laughs> it looks like he's just got loads of food in his mouth. <laughs> uh, oh, can't you scratch still? Shit. Uh, Most Pokemon are gendered. No, no, absolutely. But these are specific gendered Pokemon in the title of their name. That's what always got me weird. Like, uh, uh, Charmander, it is. Oh, the timer's gone off. Timer, timer has. Oh, God. Timer has gone off. Yes, no, thanks. Thank you. There we go. Uh, all right, so can you scratch again? I'll be honest, that was that was an okay, okay redemption. <laughs> oh, I scratch my fucking nose. Uh, right, I'm just going to nip back to the Pokemon Center. Because we're in dire need of healing. Dire need of healing. Not really. We're actually pretty alright, but... <laughs> Sorry, I was too busy paying attention to my cat. <laughs> He's just stretching out on his uh, on his little hot bed. His hot boy bed. We'll heal your Pokemon back to full health. Brr, 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 brr. My mum told me off for sexism when I cried because I had the girl need a run instead of the boy need a run. I don't know why that's that's so weird to me. And then need a queen was my favorite, was my name. Need a queen. Is that your is that your misspelling? <laughs> is that your uh, deliberate misspelling? To mess with your siblings. Because your main Pokemon. Yeah, I like the idea of them growing up into separate things and separate like final evolutions. I say final. I know it's, it's not final, but you, you know, general final evolution. Um, I just, I it always struck me as weird that those are the only ones that were specifically gendered. Like that could have been a different Pokemon. Do you know what I mean? It could have been named differently. Um. 
do they have genders on here? They don't have genders on here. Uh, aye, aye. Hey, you're not wearing shorts. Actually, mate. Oh, I'm caught in a wire. Oh, God. Think you find I am? Think you find I am? Sparrows. Now, if only I could be like Team Rocket and steal other people's Pokemon. Quick attack. Whoppa! Oh, you're level 14. Oh, I might have made a mistake. It's a growl. It's not going to do much. Quick attack. Watcha! I know, right? That's easy. I have legs. <laughs> I'm not just like Johnny Cab. I'm not just... Hope you enjoyed the ride. Quick attack. Uh, it's a very growly Spearow, isn't it? Crit girl hit. Wow, you, you nailed that one. Jeez. What Pokemon will you catch next? Um, I would like a Spearow. Um... I'm keeping my eyes out for a Magikarp because Floppy Boy, he's my he's my favourite. There's a very specific reason. I, I really like Magikarp. I I like it because I think it teaches me a good lesson that even if the only thing I can do is struggle, I can still grow from that. I know that's weird, right? But that's sort of that's I think that's why I've always liked Magikarp, because it turns into Gyarados. But all it can do is struggle. I haven't worn shorts in many, many years. I primarily wear shorts at the moment. I'm getting used to showing off my calves for when I get cut my tattoos on my calves. <laughs> I've decided I'm going to get some video game tattoos at some point. My first tattoos, but still video game tattoos. I got a list of tattoos, like um, ideas that I want for uh, powerful kind of symbols that really mean something to me. Tackle. Wa bam. Rattata is holding its own. Let me tell you. A level eleven, and it's very quickly catching up to uh, Hot Boy. Um, I will not, because it's a Metapod, so it's free XP basically. Wa bam. Yeah, I'd quite like a flying Pokemon. Um, I would quite like a grass Pokemon if we can get one. But I can't remember where they there are any. But I think a team of three, two ground, one air. Like fire, ground and air would be a pretty decent team to take on uh, Cerulean Gym, take on Misty with. Oh, yeah, that's what I was saying. I was watching um, thingy, uh, speedruns of this, speedruns of this a few days ago. And uh, I didn't realize that I'd, anything longer than an hour and a half, apparently, even though that's how long I've been going right now, um, is considered a long run of Pokemon. Who knew? I mean, it took me fucking months, years even, to complete it first time around. Right, what have we got here? But there's someone who's completed it in like 13 minutes using Spearow, fantastic. Uh, using um, if you input certain names in certain places, it alters the code of the game. I find that fascinating. So then you alter the code of the game, you go to a certain point in the game, and it creates an invisible door that then takes you straight to the um, thingy, the uh, the after the Elite Four, the Pokemon Champion ceremony bit. Uh, wild Sparrow, okay. level 100 Nido King cheat. I'm unaware of that. Uh, right, we need to be careful with this. Bosh. Okay, good, that's a good, yep. Everyone hold Dre buttons. Y 
Yeah, lots of menus, not very engaging after the first time. I like watching the ones on like AGDQ. I'm a bit obsessed with AGDQ when it comes around. And I especially like watching games like, um, hey, it's the Killer Bits. How you doing? Welcome in, everyone. Welcome in, everyone. How you doing? Come on in, sit down. There's there's drinks in the fridge. There's uh, bean bags and cushions. Come and have a come have a chill. Come have a chat. We were just talking about um, watching speedruns on AGDQ as I play through. I'm not playing a speedrun. I'm playing through for the first time in many years Pokemon Blue on original hardware. So I'm playing it on a Super Game Boy. Um, but I uh, yeah, we were talking about. Uh, watching speedruns on AGDQ and how I, I really like the um you drink all the Dr. Pepper out of the fridge already. Oh, that's fair enough. <laughs> that's alright. I'm drinking uh, Lipson's iced tea in a can. A can! Not bad, Killer Bits. Tell us about your stream. What were you streaming? I've seen you uh, on occasion um, uh, streaming like D&D stuff. So I'm interested to know what you've been, uh, what you've been up to. A lass wants to fight. Jigglypuff. Oh my god. Level 14 Jigglypuff. Can our level 11 rush I take on level 14 Jigglypuff? I think Ratboy's got it in him. Disable. Tail Whip was disabled. That's fine. It's a useless move. Oh, I didn't... Oh, I didn't make the noise. Boo. Mm. Random stuff today was uh, I can't I can't read apparently um, was Moonring Wargrove Two and Warhammer 40k Rogue Trader. That sounds cool. That sounds very cool. Well, I'm glad you come in. I'm glad you've joined us and obviously all the raiders. Thank you very much. Um, yeah. So to celebrate, to just bring things back full circle, to celebrate the 24th anniversary of Pokemon Blue, which was the one I had. Uh, we are playing, we're starting our playthrough of Pokemon Blue. Now we're going to continue it after this month. This month is spooky season and we're a spooky channel. So we primarily play horror games, present game not included. Although there is a horror version of Pokemon that I've played through as well, which is on the YouTube channel. But you can find that by using the socials command. Um, but yeah, so we're going to start it tonight. We're going to continue it after October, after Halloween. I'm going to go through a full playthrough of it. Uh, but yeah, so because it's the 24th anniversary, and I was like, it can't have been 24 years. I'm not that old. And then I'm like, oh no, no, I, I really am, aren't I? Oh no. Anyway, uh, but you missed, you did miss the part where chat made me play without my glasses for a solid 10 to 15 minutes, um, which was entertaining because I had to recognize things by sounds and splodges. So that's a thing. Uh, who do I want to change to? I'm going to change to Hot Boy because that's why Rat has a sleep. Growl was disabled. That's fine. It's a shit move. Ember! Wow, you are... Tough. Jigglypuff's made of tough stuff. Tough stuff, Jigglypuff. That's so exciting. That's so nice to say in my brain. <laughs> sounds and splodges. That sounds like an episode title right there. I mean, it might, it might turn into the episode title at some point. It's definitely going to be the title of the TikTok. <laughs> Um, right, are we, is this more trainers? Are we out of trainer battles now? Have we got more? I can't remember if we're at Cerulean City now. No, you're a trainer. I need to go back and heal. Wait, is that a sign for Cerulean City? Nope. <laughs> yeah, it is a little different from the usual fare. <laughs> I just couldn't, I've wanted this. So the, the short version of the story is... Uh, left home many years ago, lost lots of old games, including my copy of Pokemon Blue, and it's always been that sort of like yearning. Oh, I really, I'd really like to play that again, but I didn't have a Game Boy, I didn't have Pokemon Blue, and I didn't, I didn't really have the time to invest in it. So I played like re more recent Pokemon games, but I really wanted to go back to the Pokemon Blue first generation era. Um, and then in a charity shop of all places, I found the Super Game Boy, and I'm like. That's given me a brain itch. That's given me an idea, right? So then I went on eBay and I started looking at Pokemon Blue cartridges and they were 
ludicrously expensive. So I'm like, that's not happening. Then my wife found one in a secondhand store in in the town that we live in, and she brought it home. And then I'm like, well, that's that's it. I have to, like, not only do I have to play it, but I have to share this. Like, surely I'm not the only one who enjoyed Pokemon back in the day. You know, it became popular for a reason. So yeah, I really wanted to play through it and share it with the community. Yeah, you're right. Definitely, definitely uh, an aside from the normal weird itch.io horror games and phasmophobia that we normally play here on the channel. Okay, so, oh wait, are you not a trainer? Whew, I better take a rest. Ooh, that tunnel from Cerulean takes a lot out of you. Hate to raid and run, but after six and a half hours, and you grab food. That's absolutely fine. That's absolutely not a problem, Killerbase. You have an absolutely wonderful evening. I hope you enjoy your food. Thank you very much for the rain. Thank you for just being here. Posh check. That's a, that's a good shout. That is a good shout, Bruce. Undeveloped Bruce, making sure this chat's main purpose is to oh, hydrate as well. Hydrate and stretch. Oh my days. Wait a minute. This carpet is the carpet from when we moved in, so uh, hydrate, hydrate properly. Cheers, everyone. It'll be yours. Lovely. Lovely bit of iced tea in a can. Uh, what are we doing? Right. Good. Good. <laughs> well. Thanks, Brian. Uh, well, silly underscore goose, AJ, which you are just now called silly goose. That's my new favorite nickname. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Uh, what are we doing? Right, here we go. Uh, quick attack. Go. Oh, I need to train up my Spiro. Ah. Spiro used peck. You can peck off, mate. Killer Bits' audiences are like, but it can sometimes get a bit sweary in here, just so you're all aware, okay? Just keep it between us. You, me, and the rest of chat, all right? I <laughs> broke myself with the glasses. <laughs> uh, I need a switch thingy out. Spiro! More like Spino. Ah. Right, let's get you a little bit of... Let's let's see what you've got. Get your little XP, and then we'll crack on. Where's my keyboard? I don't know my keyboard. A uh, wild Spiro appeared. Go for the eyes. Oh, you're gonna peck him. <laughs> it's a peck off. Day one experience points. I need to find somewhere that sells potions. Where is this going? I can't remember this bit. Oh, this is the tunnel. Ouch! I tripped over a rocky Pokemon. Geo dude. This is. Oh, it's Mount Moon. Oh, I wonder if we can catch a Clefairy. Clefairy is one of those Pokemon that I would like to have, but I'll never use, so I'm not going to catch it. The house rules are, unless we're going to use it, we're not going to catch it. Because it's not fair on the Pokemon, right? It's 100%. I used to hate it as a kid. I used to hate the idea of having like a million Pokemon in the bag and, sorry, a million Pokemon in the in the, in the the box of the PC and never using them and them just being like basically like battery Pokemon. And I'm like, ow, ow, I don't know. I don't like Pokeballs at the best times, but... That is part of the part of the thing. So, 
Uh, at most, you can carry six Pokemon. Thanks. What's this? Ethical Pokemon. I like to think so. Uh, Team Rocket attacks Cerulean citizens. Do you know the one thing I always remember about Team Rocket is um, Jessie explaining how she used to eat freshly fallen snow because they didn't have enough money to have proper food when they were growing up. And that now makes me think I could have I could have had a, a villain origin story because I was also very poor growing up. <laughs> how it could have turned out. Ethically forcing animals to fight fight and live in tiny balls. Ethically. That's the bit you're missing. Ethically forcing animals. It's not forcing. It's just reinforced suggestions. Look, I have to deal in my day job, I have to deal with looking at the ethical implications of artificial intelligence and machine learning. Don't come at me <laughs> about the ethics of Pokemon, alright? Wow, I was not used... I did not play this in colour when I was a kid. That is what I was used to. Alright, that's the black and white version. That's the colour version. <laughs> uh, Team Rocket were such icons and relatively queer rep. They were, they were such gay icons. Like, 100%. <laughs> I found TM12. What is TM12? Greeny Green, you're my you're my lawmaster. What is TM12? I'm not even looking at it. I'm just going to assume Greeny Green's going to help me. I found potion. Suspicious men are in the cave. Water gun. Fantastic. Thank you. You fucking legend, Greeny Green. <laughs> Suspicious men are in the cave. What about you? What about you? Bugcatcher was to fight. Bugcatcher sent out Weedle. We sent out Sparrow. It was a battle for the ages. Peck it. Peck it till it dies. Peck its eyes out. It's super effective. That's because it's a bird eating a worm. What did you expect? Need a needle ran because they can learn water gun, right? So are you are you just trying to make me have your team, Bruce? <laughs> Send out Kakuna. I will not change. Fight. Peck it till it breaks. It's super effective. Give you a pallet town kiss. Douche. <laughs> Need a queen, a return of the queen. That bug guy should forgot the bird is the word. <laughs> I thought you'd be aware of a certain ornithological aspect of this game. Used peck. Now peck off. I'd like to introduce you to Spiro, my chief pecker. You want monies. Did you even take any damage then? Oh, I forgot there's wild Pokemon in here. Uh, Zubat. I hate Zubats. Like, I hate Zubats for this specific reason. They are fucking everywhere in caves. I cannot stand. They can all go away. They can be deleted. They can get in the sea. Uh, we are gone then. Beach life. Didn't work for you, though, did it? Super Sonic! I became confused. Oh, shit. I hurt itself in my co- Oh, fuck. Look away, YouTube. It's not what it looks like. Sucked health from Spiro. I'm confused no more. Used pack. Super Sonic. I am confused again. Come on, you can do this. You can do this. I believe in you, Spiro. Yes. boy. Level 9. Do we get a new move? Yes, we get a shit move. 
going against the grain of the normal good move, shit move, good move, shit move. Spiro now knows good move, shit move, shit move. Why did I want a Spiro again? Uh, beware, Zuba is a bloodsucker. It's a fucking time sink is what it is. What? I'm waiting for my friends to find me here. Well, not to sound weird, but I found you first. There's no way I could say that without that sounding really weird. Go, Clefairy! Go, Spiro! Peck. Clefairy always had this air of mystery in the... Oh, that was being the moon Pokemon. It had this air of mystery in the anime, and it just failed to deliver in the game. There's nothing mysterious or good about Clefairy. It's a good Pokemon. It's one of those, like I said, it's one of those Pokemon I always enjoy having, but I never use. Every time I redeem channel points, we get closer. <laughs> Ember! Burn it to death! Oh, that didn't work half as well as I expected it to do. Do it again! <laughs> Pound. And again. Yes! Lovely. That saves my precious PP. I mean, power points. Oh look, a Zubat. Uh, let's peck you. And the grind begins. Excellent. Leech life. Go away. Stab it. Stab it with your face. That's a quote right there. <laughs> I need to sort out the quote bot actually. I know there is a couple of quotes it is sat in the quote bot just sort of festering, but being um, being the entrepreneurial streamer that I am, I've been making a lot of TikToks recently, because uh, apparently that's, that's where the people are. Oh, fuck. Um, what? Don't sneak up on me. I, you lit, Dude, you literally walked up to me. All right. Oh, what's the, what's the guy's name? Archon. All right, Archon. You're in the wrong franchise, mate. You need to go back to your Metal Gear Solids. Super nerd. It me. <laughs> it me when younger. I had that haircut. <laughs> uh, a Magnemite. Brilliant. Electricity against flying. Let's just swap you out real quick. Magnemite, use Tackle. Because it's probably not big enough to know any electric moves yet. Tackle. Let me guess. Tackle! Nailed it. Tackle! Oh no. <laughs> Magnemite used fainted. Uh, Spiro goes to level 10. Spiro doesn't have a middle evolution, does it? Voltor. Voltor always used to freak me out. Because he looks so much like a Pokemon. No, no, actually, I don't think it will. Voltorb's probably the closest thing you could get, other than missing them, to an anomaly in the uh, in the Pokemon universe. It's like, oh, I'm just gonna pick up this. I'm just gonna pick up this uh, this Pokeball. Now I'm electrocuted. Although they're massive, so how, I'm not sure why you mistakenly pick up a Voltorb. You'd have to pick it up like an Atlas Stone. My Pokemon won't do. Well, I don't want to say that to you, mate. Oh, look. Oh, fuck. I love that occasionally the music plays slightly too fast because it's running off original hardware. I, I just, I love that every now and then there's a slight inconsistency. <laughs> It may not even be noticeable, but because I work with audio quite a lot, I've, I, I just pick up on it every now and then, and I'm like, that's slightly different. <laughs> the beat's slightly quicker. Now, whether it's supposed to be or not, I'm not sure, but yeah, the beat's slightly quicker. 
It hurt itself in the confusion. Oh, I did more damage to me than you did this entire fight. Come on, let's go, go big or go home. No! No! Poo! Well, at least we've got another Pokemon to fall back on. Grasta, you can have this one. Add a girl, Rata. Add a girl. Ooh, level 12 as well. Lovely. He found a potion! Lovely. Uh, now... I might just have to soldier on. I hadn't even moved yet. Oh, a Geodude! I quite like Geodudes. I mean, I'd go for an Onyx right now. Uh, well, hang on. What can you catch in the Mount Moon Tunnel? Mount Moon Tunnel. Unless our resident um, Pokemon Lore Master, Greeny Green, wants to field this one. I'll give him a second. What can I what can I find in the Mount Moon Tunnel? What Pokemon? Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Clefairy, Paras, and everything else you've seen. Excellent. Oh, Paras. Ooh. That's probably the only like poison poisony Pokemon I'd consider. I think Paras. So no onyx then. We don't, we don't just randomly catch an onyx here, which is unfortunate. Uh, you are level ten. Let's scratch you. It's the dark cave. Got it. I love that you say that. Like I'll remember where that is. I love that there's this assumed knowledge. I I remember there is a cave that is dark. <laughs> That's all I remember, though. Oh, wait, is it the one where I... You know when you hit it. Is it the one where I need flash? Do I need flash for that one? Right, let's try and catch... Uh, where do I want a Geodude? I don't think I want a Geodude. I don't want a Geodude. I'm not going to use it. I want to hold out. I want to hold out for an Onyx. Onyx is going to be my rock boy. Scratch. Oh no, not in Gen 1, you can just see the outlines of the walls. Oh, what, when you use Flash? Uh, mushroom and Crab, so good. <laughs> I'm glad to see this, uh, this other Paris fans out there. It's weird, because I don't normally like um, Poisony Pokemon or Status Pokemon, uh, but Paris definitely. I think because it was so... Oh, without Flash, you can just see the walls, but no trainers arrived. Got it. I think it was because it was so adorable in the anime that I really liked it. These potions are limited, so I need to be careful. You found a rare candle. Oh, fuck, I forgot they existed. Jesus. Aye, aye. Go through this cave to get to Cerulean City. <laughs> I vaguely remember this is not a small cave either. Like, I might actually need to go back at some point. Go, hot boy! Uh, Ember. We're not fucking around anymore. You're about to use Metapod. Will you change Pokemon? Yes, I will. Rata, your time to shine. Nothing boosts your... Uh, confidence and experience more than killing an enemy that can't attack back. So I think an understanding of how many Pokemon I'm going to have in total would be good. I'd like to have just six, like a single pie, no PC run, right? A single pie run. I'm just not sure how realistic that is. 
yeah, I'm not sure how realistic this is. There's so many different types, but if we just level up six key Pokemon, a single party, then we should be able to take on anything, right? Uh, oh shit, what am I fighting? Let's, let's go in there. Oh, Catapig, that's okay. Maybe that's what I should do. Maybe when we continue this, I could be like, we're not having more than six. And if we do have to, like we only have six, but then when we catch another one, we have to let one go. That could be a good house rule. Um, quick attack. Speed fell, that's fine. Tackle! I lost. You also don't have a lot of money on you, you fucking cheapskate. Let me guess, it's a Zubat. It's a Zubat. Of course it is. No, thank you. Not today. Am I right in thinking that Charizard isn't actually that higher level? Like, it, to get to Charizard from Charm... From Charmander to Charmeleon and Charmeleon to Charizard, I want to say it's like 30... Maybe thir 32 sticks in my head for some reason. I'm not sure why. I was originally going to say 26, but I don't think that's right. Greeny Green's going to slide in with the, with the Lord look at any second. Oh, fuck. Yeah, those repels. They're really starting to look appealing right now. But then how would we level up? Hey, eh? how would we level up? Ember. 36 Charizard. Nice. Oh, it wasn't far off. It wasn't far off. It's so weird that you get such what I would consider... I, oh, good. A Zubat. I'll mute this. Right, sorry about that. Uh, was it this one? Yes, it was that one. Good. Not very effective. What happened to the sound then? It's because I, I muted it. It's angry at me. Right, I can go one step, right? Oh god, I found an escape rope. Good. I, uh, I, I was going to say I'm not going to use that. I'll never use it. But uh, do you know what? It might be a thing. <laughs> Oh, well, hang on. It's because I've got a website open, isn't it? My entire system decides that it wants to slow down the minute I have a website open. Like on Chrome. If I have a Chrome tab open, I've got a stream manager open right now. I'm going to close it. So, I mean, I normally have it closed anyway. But even like streaming, like doing the stream through the, through the system, something slows it all down. It's weird. Maybe it's the CPU, I'm not sure. We'll fix that at some point this weekend because I've actually got a new motherboard sat over there in a box. That's just Chrome. It's just Chrome in general. Um, so I'm going to do some phone-style video recording of me uh, trying to... Basically, I'm going to hold... I'm going to try and not grab my PC with my... Hold my phone like that, like a proper YouTuber. And then be like, Oh, hey, guys, it's just me. Oh, <laughs> I'm trying to fucking drop that on myself. <laughs> or the microphone. 
Um, but yeah, so I'm going to upgrade my motherboard on my PC because ages and ages ago, I got a really good deal on a good CPU and fucking all this forehead and I couldn't think, uh, is it compatible with my current, current motherboard? No, was the answer. But it is compatible with my new motherboard. So, and it goes up two generations. So it goes from an I... I can't remember what I'm on, but it goes up to an i7 and a good i7 as well. So, and it was like dirt cheap. So, and this motherboard also supports i9s. So I don't know when I want to upgrade, and I, you know, when the 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 cycle of tech upgrade for the company comes around. Oddish, sorry, I like Oddish. Um, then I can upgrade to an i9 at some point. I love Oddish. Burn it to death. Scratch its face off. Good. I was a little bit worried that wasn't going to work then. Audio is a bit desynced. Well. Well. It's not like I do that. As in, like. Me or the game? The game. Is it? How weird. Um, hang on, hang on. Sorted it. I sorted it. It's fine. I sorted it. Don't, don't you worry, Echo. You're here to look after me, and I appreciate that. Good. No, hopefully that's all right. Uh, that basically I unmuted when I muted the audio a second ago I unmuted the wrong source I have two sources one is the wonky source and one is not the wonky source however if I delete the wonky source the non-wonky source stops so I had to have both but mute one so who the bell sprouts for whom the bell sprouts bell sprouts always used to creep me out a little bit as well they were one of those they were one of those Pokemon They always look like they were up to summer, like behind the eyes. No issues with Weeping Mill and Victory Bell. No issues whatsoever. I completely forgot I was fighting a trainer then. I gotta be honest with you, I was paying no real attention to what I was doing. Yeah, I vaguely remember this being a quite large cave. Oh good, a Zubat. Just what I wanted to encounter. Burn it to death. Oh no, I'm nearly out of PP. No man wants to be wants to run out of PP. A ladder, good. What's is there an item over here that I wanna? Nope, apparently not. I love bells, bro, because they look like daffodils before the buds open. Uh, yeah, they do actually. I never really thought about it like that. I never really knew flowers when I was a kid, though. So, and I guess I, I, as a, I say I'm at all, as a grown-up child, uh, I, I never thought about it before. As an old man, oldest man on Twitch, don't mind me. I'm just going to sit here and play my stories. Fucking hell, Echo. <laughs> Since you mentioned Super Mario 64 earlier, did I mention Super Mario 64 earlier? Uh, me and a few friends of mine were at a quiz last Friday night. One question we got was, which game and console is this from? And then a friend of mine played a tune from Super Mario Brothers, which I immediately recognized. He played off a segment of the underwater level. That is a pretty iconic song, to be honest with you. Do you mean, like, Dry Dry... Oh, no, the Su Super Mario 64 or Super Mario Brothers? Because the Super Mario Brothers one's super iconic. The Super Mario 64 Dry Dock level is a bit more obscure. Um... But you're right. That wow, well remembered. I I've had a passing mention of uh, Super Mario when I mentioned Bob on Battlefield. I think. Still to this day, one of my favourite songs. Uh, are you a? Uh, yeah, you are. Did you come to Explore Two? No, I came to mug simpletons like you. Now give me your cash. Sent out Ratata. I got one of those. Only mine's better than yours. This is my. Origin story, my villain origin story. 
I mentioned Bob and Battlefield earlier. Yep, you're absolutely right. Well, well remembered, because I had forgotten about that. You are my replay buffer, Echo, without a shadow of a doubt. You're the reason why they say the internet never forgets. Uh, I will change Pokemon, and I will change to Rattata. We're all looking a little ropey. I'm not going to lie, we've looked better. Quick attack. Quick sticks. I'm so out of the news for gaming now. I didn't even realise there was a new Super Mario Brothers coming out. Like, I had no idea until... I actually think until... I picked my Switch up the other night and I turned it on. And... About the audio desync is a clip. Okay, cool. Thank you. I'm assuming it's not desynced anymore. Uh, it's... Oh, what was I saying? Yeah, I picked my Switch up the other night. It's got some Cozy Grove. And I... Um, which is a fucking brilliant game. And I'm going to be doing a series on it at some point for local gaming. I uh, saw the news section on the left-hand side of the Switch. And it was like, oh, new Super Mario Brothers game. I'm like, what? Am I am I that out of that out of touch with gaming now? Like, yes, is the answer. Good. I was a bit worried something was going to try and kill me. Then I'm not going to lie. I had this weird feeling that I had not paid attention for so long that it um, that I was going to lose. Now I don't really want to. Oh, okay. That's the ladder I want to go down. I vaguely remember that. My kind of moonstone. How exciting. That seems like it would fetch a high price to the right buyer. Uh, Ember. Good. Right, let's go down. Fuck. Paris! Fucking Paris. Right, be careful now. Be careful, he's a hero. Alright, let's be very careful here. <laughs> I love that. I just got an email from LinkedIn saying, you appeared in 362 searches this week. I'm like, thank you. That's worthless. <laughs> Potion? Potion. <coughs> Time for a crap rave. That song never sticks in my head, but whenever I hear it, I have to listen to all of it. It's just one of those one of those songs. Um, tackle. Careful, careful. Right, okay. Scratch. At ten. Everyone, hold your A buttons down. Yeah, fifty percent of the time it works every time. <laughs> That's such a good noise. Burrows to suck tree roots. The mushrooms on its back grow by drawing nutrients from the bug host. Do you want to give it in Paris? No. Yeah. Let's go down here first. I'm pretty sure this is just a bonus bit. Uh, oh, you're Team Rocket, aren't you? I'm going to be very careful with this. TM1, got it, thank you. <gasps> a Clefairy! I'm not catching a Clefairy. Go, hot boy. Sorry, Clefairy, you got to go. Oh, God. Again, love the idea of a Clefairy. We'll never use a Clefairy. Looks like a cinnamon roll could kill you. <laughs> uh, right, you are Team Rocket, which means I probably want to jumble stuff around a little bit. I'm not going to have the resources to fight you. I'm going to save. The first save? <laughs> Fucking hell. You want to save Hobie, but yeah, it's fine. Yeah, I would say. 
We're pulling a big job here. Get lost, kid. Tell me they're not dressed to go to a gay club. <laughs> Sent out Zuba, a level 12 Zuba. Oh, there's no PP. No, Hot Boy ran out of PP. Cassis. Well, I mean, in fairness. Ooh. One HP. I'll take that back, thanks. <laughs> Ow. Spooky Pokemon fact. Ha wait, stop, pause. Sorry. Spooky Pokemon fact. The reason Parasects has such big mushrooms is that when it evolves, the mushrooms take over and control the bug, which is why it has dead eyes. Some Pokemon have very creepy Pokedex entries that tell some dark stories. Indeed. I didn't... I forgot about that, actually. I didn't know about that fully. I knew there was something... There was a Pokemon that was controlled by a Parasite. I didn't know it was Parasite. I mean, we all know the Cubone story, which is terrible. Um, there was another one as well, wasn't there? Not Marowak. Um, and not not the ghosts. Oh, was it not like Abra or Kadabra or something like that? The one that steals kids. There's a there's a Pokemon that steals children. <laughs> I'm not making this up, people. I'm genuinely not making this up. There's a Pokemon that steals kids. <laughs> uh, no, I will not change Pokemon. There's more than one! There's one of the, the aficionado, the fucking lawmaster in chat. Official curator of the Pokemon Law Museum. Oh, get. Just piss off. Get off. Piss off, Snake. <laughs> Good old hot boy. Defeated Rocket. Such a fierce outfit. So, you are good. Money. What are you going to save me now? If you find a fossil, give it to me and scram. I found an ether. Okay, ethers are a thing in here. I forgot. B -b -b Bonus. B -b -b oh, I can't use that noise. Ditch Inferno's not here. I've got an MLG horn on my soundboard. I can only use it if one specific member of chat turns up. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, are we going to try and level Paris up a bit? Uh, switch. Drowsy and or Hypno have something mentioned like that. There's a ghost balloon Pokemon that gets kids to hold it and then carries them off in later gens as well. Fucking hell. And you said this, and they said this was off brand for a horror channel. Absolutely not. Hi, mate. Whoa, you shocked me. Oh, you're just a kid. Just a kid that's about to empty your pockets, mate. All right, Brian Blessed. Calm down. Hi, can I send out Geo Dude. Paris is level 8, but it is injured. And it only knows Scratch. Mm. Yeah, let's talk about Hot Boy's, Hot Boy's going to carry us for a little bit. Don't get me wrong. I, I, I love Paris as much as the next person, but I need to get it at least a couple of levels higher before we... We've got no BB again. Fuck. I keep forgetting about that. I could use the ether, but I don't want to. So. Oh, no. Oh, no. The potion's not fucking there, is it? Uh, uh... Right. Ether. Hot Boy. Ember. PP was restored. Tackle. This feels like a waste. Ember. Tackle. I'm still going to be alive. Ember. Good. Not very effective. That's fine. You fainted. We all gain experience. Good, good. You're about to use Geodude again. Yes, I will swap Pokemon. That noise is annoying as fuck. Okay, bring you back. Send out Rattata. Quick attack. Wabam. How dare you have high fucking defense. Oh, this, this isn't going to go very well for me, is it? I don't think I should have done this. <laughs> go, Paris. <laughs> I don't have any potions, do I? This could be a TPK right here. Items. No. No, I don't. 
Wait, can I use the escape rope in battle? <laughs> Mike, this isn't the time to use that. Where the fuck did your voice come from? Paris, scratch. Geodo used tackle and obliterates Paris. Oh, Paris. Ooh. But, right. It's not gonna end well for us. It's not gonna end well for us. Ember. It's not very effective. Tackle. Death. Oh no, we've got one hit point left. But we have another Pokemon to fight, which is unfortunate. One hit point and a dream. One hit point and a dream. And it's a fucking Onyx. Of course it is. I know Hot Boy's already out. I don't want to look bad in front of an Onyx. <laughs> Ember. No. No. If it had used Bide, that would have been fine. Faded. Mike's out using my Pokemon. My blocked out. That's all right. Death count two. Burr. Uh, we're all healed now, though, right? Like, we're all okay? Pokemon? Yeah, we're all fine. Good. Uh... Hey, I developed Bruce. Thank you so much for subscribing for the last six months. Holy shit, thank you so much. That's amazing, thank you. <laughs> oh, a Zubat. I really appreciate that, Bruce. Thank you so much. Peck. Doosh. Come on, you got this, you got this. Don't thank me, it's only to get channel points faster so I can steal glasses. God damn it, Bruce. <laughs> Stop trying to steal things from me. Steal my heat, steal my glasses. Okay, now. I have to start gluing stuff down around you. Back. <laughs> uh, did we go in this? No, we didn't, did we? So you could say that that fainting was a blessing in disguise, because now we found a tunnel we didn't go in. Oh, got one of those little scratches. You know, you know one of those little scratches right at the back of your throat? had one all day. I've had one of those days where I've, been, I've done nothing but talk. Um, I haven't been in meetings. I just like the sound of my voice. But it's been one of those days. So I feel like in like a day or two, I'm going to have a really rough throat. Throat? That's not how you say that word. Throat. Use my tongue. Use my tongue to full effect. Throat. Peck it. Hit it. Just hit it. It's a wild Zubat. Just tear it apart with your talons. Down in. Wait, what's in it? Oh, God. Oh, wait. No, is this not the thing? Is this not the... Fossil? Um, I can't remember if air is good against rock. Leer. What does Leer do? Your defense fell. Cool. I don't know how much, how, how good that's going to be against it. Uh, also, I'm dying. Let me just uh, call you back. Send out Rata. If you could just mop this up for me real quick, that'd be great. Thanks. Uh, do a tackle. I think quick attack is less damage than tackle. I'm not sure. That was a critical hit. Quick attack. Okay, quick time over then, because I'm pretty sure that was... Hey, you missed! Fantastic. I'm pretty sure that was more damage than the critical attack of Tackle, so... Right, so you're there. Oh, okay, this is just a... an item. Got it. HP up! Hey. Just. Yeah, that's fine. Ah! Go 
strength. We, Team Rocket, are Pokemon gangsters. Rocket wants to fight. Send out Sandshrew. Oh, look at its face. Look at its face. Uh, I'm going to swap you out immediately, hot boy. Immediately. Don't look, everyone. <laughs> but if we could burn the central to death, that would be great. As it just flails around. He's so cute in general. He's so cute in general. It looks like... Um, what is it? Is it like a mole? It's a mole that's modeled on, isn't it? It, looks, it has a mole face. Uh, sure. Why not? This is going to be a tough rat over the air. Let's try it. Tail whip. My defense fell. Scratch. I mean, you could do it if it doesn't annihilate you. But it's going to annihilate you. So I'm going to drag you back. Sorry, buddy. Tackle? I don't think so. What the hell? Sometimes Ember is not the only weapon in the arsenal. It's the most useful, don't get me wrong. And Zubat. Uh, no, I'll just let Hot Boy finish this off. Once again, I forgot I was fighting a, a trainer, not just random Pokemon. Super Phonic. Oh, he became confused. Don't be confused. But you, you can be confused and do that. That's fine. Critical hit. They fainted. Hot Boy gained 126 points of experience. Mike defeated Rocket. Oh, I blew it. Mike got 330 money for winning. Now he's rich. Uh, now I kind of do need to go back. I'm going to go back to the Pokemon Center. Heal up. Because that was a detour, right? Um, yeah. Peck it to death. Peck it till it dies. I mean, it's going to take two, maybe three. Now it's definitely going to take three. Let's get crit. Nope. No such luck. No such luck. Wabam! See, it's all fun and games until we come to Mount Moon Tunnel, and then it's nothing but wall to wall Zubats. Gain a level, though. I do think it's unfair that the Pokemon don't regain health when they gain a level. That's something I've come to expect from games. <laughs> Is using that buff. <laughs> Maybe because they uh, level up so quickly. Mm. Mm, excuse me. Stupid early morning meetings. There was a meeting at 8 o'clock in the morning. Sociopaths, that's who book meetings for 8 o'clock in the morning. I was so close. Oh, it's a Geodude as well. No, fuck off. Pokemon! Hello, Joy. We hope to see you again. Uh, right, where is the Pokemon? Because I've got, I think I've got some cash money now. I do, which means I want to go buy some potions. Be right back, just name it to the shops. Oh, I didn't miss anyone here. Uh, like um, that would be real awkward. No, you all got. I'm an equal opportunity marauder. You all got a, a proper Pokemon spanking. Oh, I pressed the wrong button again. Did you ever max out monies in a Pokemon game? Um, not legitimately, no. Uh, purchase. 
Uh, push ones? Wait, what else? What else am I gonna need? Ha what else have I got? Let me wait. What can I sell? <laughs> All right, let's let's start this off. How much do you want from this? Nothing. What do you mean nothing? Take it. I don't want to give you peacekeeper. Oh my god. How much does that increase my fucking fuck it? I never use shit like this. I never ever use it. I don't want the moonstone. I don't I don't think I'll ever use it. That's worth a thousand. That's worth five hundred. That's worth fifteen hundred. Okay. So I need some pokeballs. Bye. I'm gonna say two more pokeballs. I'm gonna say not necessarily the rest on potions, but like five, ten potions, fifteen potions. There we go. There we go. Now we've got a backstock, which is good. And now all I'm gonna do is buy a burn heal. I'll buy an emergency awakening just in case. Right, cool. Very good day to you, madam. And we will see you later. I love how the character sprites move independently of the background. I remember I had a... Um... God, I used to know so much about Pokemon. I don't. I still don't know to this day. I still don't know if the way of getting Mew in Pokemon Gen One Game Boy cartridges is legitimate or not. I never did it when I was younger, but whenever I see someone doing it on a video now, I'm like, is that? But is that original or is that emulated? Like, how much of this is rubbish? Why old Zubat appeared? Back it, back it to death. Oh, I went to put my foot up on the footrest that I've got, and I've got it covered in wires because I had to very quickly uh, uh, set this up. <laughs> Boo. That's okay. When I update my thingy, um, it's from an in-person event if it's the legit Mew in Gen 1. Oh, I see. I see. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of, but I think I'm not sure if... It didn't look like a legit way of doing it. It was one of those, go to certain positions, fudge the code, and go through a door, and suddenly you're fighting a Mew. Do you know what I mean? Wild Geodude appeared. I'm not 100% sure I want to fight a Geodude. They have very high defense, and they batter the fuck out of me. So I'm probably going to give that a miss. I fought enough rock Pokemon in my life right now. Oh good, another very rare Clefairy. I'm going to have to pummel it to death. Heck. Pointless move. <laughs> Utterly pointless move. Oh, fuck. Okay, maybe it wasn't a pointless move because you just lowered my attack. It wasn't as pointless. But the battery should have died by now in all those game cartridges, so I doubt there's any left unless someone trapped it, uh, traded it up through to newer games. Maybe. Maybe. You can just replace the battery though, right? Like, or does that remove the save functionality? Like, that was something I had to check uh, with this, is that it saved, because that's how you save, because you need the battery, right? As far as I know. Dude, I don't, I don't like fighting these Geodudes. They don't give me a lot of XP, and they've got a very high defense. So, knob off, mate. Um, I, I'm assuming during the swap over, it will wipe, wipe it without the battery for those two seconds. Yeah. That's what I thought might happen. Right, let's go through... Let's go, go and try and fight this hiker again. Because now we're fully healed. We're healed and peeled. I mean, you can take that on. I'm not sure. It's super effective. Oh, wow. Okay. I don't know if DS cartridges also have internal batteries. They may have solved that problem by that point. I'm not 100% sure. Oh,
Do you mind? Good on you, Paris. Good on you. Let me guess, did you use to spell Paris with an I, Bruce? By any chance? Because that's what I would do if I was going to misspell Paris. Paris, yep, excellent. <laughs> oh, you shocked me. Oh, you're just a kid. Yeah, I'm the kid you knocked out about 20 minutes ago, mate. I'm the kid you scared so much I blacked out. Uh, right, so we'll swap out this for you. Phew. Use tackle. It's rubbish. Ember. I know it's not very effective. It's the only thing I've got, though. Although, can Paris learn water gun? That would be an interesting thing to find out. If Paris can learn water gun. I don't think it can because it's a bug Pokemon. Paris could level 9. Hooray. Hobbit goes level 20! Yay! Ico's about to use Geodude! Will you change my point? Yes. Paris. Everyone gets to Come, come. Everyone, everyone try and stay. I mean, the start of Pokemon is always going to be out front. Everyone try and stay in the same bracket of levels. No, I didn't mean you to actually attack it. Oh, piss. Sorry, Paris. Sorry. That was a misclick on my part. Actually, technically two misclicks on my part because I had to press fight and then the move. So that was that was muscle memory, but it's cost Paris its consciousness. It's not very effective. You use tackle. It's not very effective. Let's just get you out of the way. I can about to use Onyx. No, I will stick with Hot Boy. Jesus. It's not very effective, but it took half his health off. Wa bam As a reward I will take your onyx. Whoa, shocked again. Good, now get out of the way. Cause I think is this not three floors or four floors? I can't remember. Let's go this way. Sure. Ow. What we got? Zubat. Crosses. It's Zubats all the way down. Spiro. Uh, Peck it? I mean, it's level 10, but... Oh, don't confuse it. I mean, there's no point in me not using a move, because if I use a shit move and it hurts itself, it's still going to hurt itself. If I use a good move and it doesn't hurt itself, it's still going to use a good move. Or it could knock itself out, which is something completely possible. So let's maybe just take you out of the running for a second. Uh, no, let's, oh boy, <laughs> if you could just step in. Uh, Ember. Kablamo. And now if we could just... Wait, how do I... Ah, that's how I change things. Good. That's how I change items. Potions at the top, because no one does that. There, Spiro, you have that. Good, good. Excellent. Uh, right. Moves? Oh, wait, no. Moves? What was this one? 34? Boot the TM. He says, bide. Uh, no. Move that to the bottom. Because I'm never using bite. That's going to be sold. This is... Oh, Mega Punch. Yeah, go for it. Mega Punch. Hot Boy, do you want to learn Mega Punch? I think Hot Boy, Hot Boy probably wants to learn Mega Punch. He's trying to learn Mega Punch. Actually, no, let's not. Delete all movement. No. Hot Boy's got a lot going for it. Abandon all movement. Yes. Hot Boy did not learn Mega Punch. Okay. Hot Boy's got a lot going for him. So let's not do that. Water gun. Teach all Pokemon. 
Oh, Rust second level. Yeah, you go for it. Yeah, why not? They now have a water move. Fantastic. Lovely. Uh, speaking of which, you can go first. Lovely. Wait, awakening. That's not a revive, is it? An awakening. No, okay, that just awakens from sleep. Oh my god. I literally, I was on the, the same pixel when I pressed the button. Go, right attack. Go, quick attack. Heal sleep, thank you. Cheers, James. Um, I, yeah, I should probably grab some revives as well. It's the weird terminology. It's awakening. I'm like... But they faint, so could it be... The little kids should leave grown-ups alone. I... and vice versa, mate. Let's be honest. Raticate. Rata, that's what you're aiming for. I mean, from the look of it, you're not far off. Uh, I don't want to use a war one. Let's use quick attack. Level 16, though, so I'm not sure I should... Hyper Fang, that's unfortunate. Ouch. Okay, that's that's on me. That was a bad choice on my part. I wasn't thinking. Ember? Ember? Yes, great. Lovely stuff. Defeated Rocket. I'm steamed. And I'm streamed. Uh, okay, so around here, around here, around here. <laughs> oh. Gen 1 has quite a few impossible Pokemon that are too low level to be that evolved. Oh, I see. <laughs> I was say 16 is very low to level up for a rack. Rattata Maybe it is. I don't know. I can't remember when Charmander evolves Charmeleon, but that's that's only that's a three level evolution rather than a two level evolution, you know? Two level evolution. That, that's quite hard to say. Satisfying when you say it though. Peck. Dead. <laughs> Uh, hang on. Who needs who needs a heal? Do you need a heal? Hot boy needs a heal. Good, good. Sparrow could probably do. Well, no, Sparrow's only missing ten, so leave that leave that be for now. Unfortunately. Now, how's this one gonna go? Use pack on that. Pretty well. That pretty well. Yep. That worked. Good going, Spiro. <laughs> oh hi. Team Rocket will find the fossils, revive and sell them for cash. Cash cash cash. cash. Rocket wants to fight. Turn out Rajda. Go, Spiro. Uh back. Tail Hoy. Good. Oh, there's a crit. I mean, that's not great for a crit. God! Oh, that's because you used Tail Whip on me. My defense was low. Cheeky drink. Treat yourself. Quick attack. Jeez. Alright, hot boy. Step in, please. It's, if you don't mind. Hot boy! Uh, what? Uh, yeah, it's not, it's not gonna work on me. Anyway. Ah, good. Hot boy grew to level 21. About to use Zuba. No, I'll stick with Hot boy. Thanks. Ember. Now we'll bring out Hot boy, also known as the Equalizer. <laughs> there we go. 
Oh boy's my insurance policy. Uh, Alright, speaking of which, uh, bibbidi bobbidi boop, I heal you. Why not? I'm feeling, I'm feeling flush, so have another one. Have another one, you cheeky sound sound. What have we got in here? We've got fossils. Oh, fa! <laughs> Zubat. sat on my leg and I'm in my 30s so now my entire left hand side has gone numb there we go. Do, 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 do. right is there anything over there nope good hello hey stop I found these fossils they're both mine right um greeny green uh, which fossil does what I really like Grimer and Muck in the anime. I don't like how they look in this. They look daft. Um, I am going to use Peck on you. Greeny Green is just my lifeline to the Pokemon General Mucky at this point. There's a lot of stuff I remember. I definitely don't remember which fossil turns into what. Ooh. Ooh. Surprise, it's your birthday. What? Oh, because of the, the hands in the air. That's what it looks like it's saying. Surprise. Okay, cool. That was, that was a more reasonable hit. It looks like someone melted the cookie monster. Uh, I'm not going to survive another one of those. Hot boy. Uh, Dome is Kabuto, and Helix is Omanai and Amastar. Cool. Eh, uh, don't worry about spelling. Absolutely. Uh, switch. Although, I'm not sure... Do I want those? I don't know I want them. Omastar, maybe. Omastar's water as well, isn't it? <coughs> Just wants a hug. <laughs> uh, Volt up. Nah, no, I'm safe, thanks. I'm solid where I am. Come here, Volty. Burn it to death. And you're burned. And you use tackle. I just imagine Volt up's tackle is just like it rolling over my foot. Burn! Coughing. Oh no, I don't want to. No. Oh, boy, sorry, I know. I'm sticking with coughing. Coughing as well. I think they did coughing dirty with the, with the Game Boy game. Because that is not as good as coughing looks in the anime. There's a lot of that. Smog. How about I set that smog on fire? Right, let's have a quick look. What are those types of Pokemon? What is a Gen 1? Kabutops, Kabuto, Kabutops. Uh, Bulbapedia is what I want. What? I just want to know what type you are. What type are you? You are not telling me, Bulbapedia. You are rubbish. That is a rock, a rock water, Kabuto. Oh, Kabuto, Kabutops, I should say. It's under the pick on the right of Bulbapedia. On the right of Bulbapedia. Rockwater, good, good, thank you. And all night, all night, all night, 
Omelette. What are you? Rock water, rock water. Okay, cool. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I mean... Out of the two, Kabutops looks better than Omastar. But Omanite looks cuter than Kabuto. So, I don't know. I got 300 monies for that. Thanks for that, by the way. Greeny green. I appreciate that. Uh, right. What do you got to say? No, oh, we'll each take one. No being greedy. You want the Helix Fossil? No. I want the Dome Fossil. Dome Fossil. Alright, then this is mine. Okay, bye. <laughs> ah, bye bye then. I'm off. Ah, bye bye. <laughs> Alright, good. We're out. Yay. Report. Map moves to release it. Is this packed full of people? Is this all peoply? Or is this not? Because I'd quite like to get to a point where we can save. Oh, an item. TM4. What's TM4? What TM4 be? Whirlwind. Yes. Now, do you already learn Whirlwind, Spiro? Let's just go on to... Spiro. 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 Moves. Did you tell me the moves as well, Bulbapedia? Uh, Gen 1? Uh, okay. You do not... Oh, you do learn Whirlwind. Wait, no. You do learn Whirlwind. I think. Whirlwind, no competitive use. Well, that's going in the bin. That can stay down there. That's being sold. Can I get to Cerulean City from here? Or is there another? Oh, yes. Oh, look at that. It's all blue. Again, just for anyone who's not tuned in yet, I'm so used to this being the color scheme because I played it on the Game Boy. Originally, I've never played through it in color. So it being blue is a big thing to me. <laughs> okay, center. Ah, lovely. Can you just heal all these, please? You should, you should heal these. Thanks. Thanks, mate. Thanks, Joy. Miss you, love you, bye. Uh, Pokemon Mart as well. No, that's not the Pokemon Mart. Wait, what is this? I've forgotten. Grass and caves handled easily. Bike shop. I remember the bike shop. Uh, Pokemon Mart, that's what we need. Appears to be being guarded by a generic Pokemon sprite. Hello. Slow bro. Oh god, Chrome. Fucking hell. Kill Chrome. Uh, I wish to sell some stuff. Can you buy this TM from me? 500? Yep, thank you. Uh, no, no potions. Can you buy this one from me? 1,000. Lovely. Uh, would you be interested in a fossil? No. You can't put a price on that. So you're saying it's priceless? <laughs> I see. <laughs> uh, purchase. I would like some. Wait, is there? Yeah, there must. Be... I'm sure there's things that bring Pokemon back from thingy. Slaw, bro, brilliant. From unconsciousness. Buy another. Yeah, that'll do. Another nine of those. Get some of these. Some of these. Some of those. One of these. Some of that. Lovely. Lovely. Let's um, go and give a, a gym person a poke. Uh, Pokemon? Yeah, Rattata, why not? You can go out first. Da -da 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 -da. This will give me a good idea of what level it's be. Splash, splash, I'm first up. Let's do this. 
Was there not a thing about the water here? Was it not like an invalid sprite or something? You look... <laughs> you look like Voldemort at the end of the Harry Potter trilogy, uh, the Harry Potter series. <laughs> you look... Swimmer, I'm afraid to say this, you look like someone's destroyed all your Horcruxes. <laughs> Oh, horsey's pretty badass. Right, um, level 16. Interesting. Very quiet. Bubble. Quick attack. Wabam. Not a quick attack. Bubbles. Quick attack. Wabam. Quick hit. No. Bubbles. You're not looking great, mate. Here, yeah, have some juice. Have some fighting juice. Bubbles! <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a constant game of me just topping up my rats now, isn't it? Spiro, do the do your job. Spiro! <laughs> Bubbles! <laughs> wow, that was a fucking shit show, wasn't it? Oh, you're faster than my Spiro. Of course you are. Taken down a peg or two by a by a horsey. Hot boy. This is a bad idea, but hot boy. Yes, I'm aware this is going to be devastating to him. Apparently, it's going to be devastating to him. Scratch it. Scratch its face off. Like him face off. Where well, they took their face off. Yeah, but we all gained some, didn't we? Shoulder. Uh, yes, I will. I will change to Paris because Paris needs the XP. Shoulder always looks like such a dope. <laughs> oh boy. Paris, enough. Come back. Uh, Shoulder use withdraw. Shoulder defense rose. Well, that's not going to be much good when you're on fire. Apparently it is. Withdraw your defense rose. Fire! Withdraw your defense rose. Oh my god, are you just a, a metapod or a cocoon? The cat can get out. Withdraw! Defense Rose, you're hurt by the burn! Scratch. Scratch it. Nice. This this can't be. Oh, it can. Bye-bye now. <laughs> right, so we need to level up a bit but we're not too far away. Which is great, because we're closing in on closing time, basically, on the old stream shop. Uh, have you heard about Bill? Everyone calls him a Pokemaniac. I think people are just jealous of Bill, though. Who wouldn't want to boast about their Pokemon? Bill sounds like a bit of a dick. Um, yeah, heal, please. Fighting fit. Alright, so we're gonna save. I'm gonna stand here.